Hello. Good evening. Hi. Welcome back to Final Fantasy XIV Stormblood. Yeah, it's been a couple of days since we last played. Shocker, I know. And uh, we're back. I'm just going to log into Discord real quick and uh, check out if my man Tomzy, Tomzy's here already. I know he's here because I've seen his Discord notification. He's currently muted. What's up? I'm Smooth. We're back with more Final Fantasy XIV Stormblood. Hopefully we will be wrapping it up soon. Because the uh, last session actually quite drained me, honestly. And uh, yeah, let's get the show on the road. Let's see. Let's get that camera up here so you guys can actually see what the hell's going on. Rick Cleary is here. What's up, brother? No, that's actually a um, song from Devil May Cry 5 by a guy called Victor Borba with... Uh, Christ, what was the other artist called? Um, Casey... Uh, uh, the name will come back to me in a moment, but... It was from Devil May Cry 5, uh, from the soundtrack. It's the battle theme of Virgil from da uh, Devil May Cry 5. Yeah, I, I mean, I've been shaved... The last couple of days as well. The beard is regrowing though, luckily. So here's open that will uh, clear things up a little bit. And hi. So let's get this show on the road, shall we? How's it going, Pete? And how are you doing, Rick? Hope you're doing well, my friend. It's good to see you. It's good to see you guys. It's good to see you. So we are live with the smooth We are live. DJ. Hello. Hello, hello. How's it How's going? It? Mate, I'm living a dream. I've had a little sleep this afternoon, so... Oh, I I, so I've been told. <laughs> yeah. it... I was like, I'm surprised I even woke up. You desperately needed it, huh? Um, I, th I think it was a food coma. Um, so I oh. had essentially cooked dinner. <laughs> and both me and Tam then just passed out. Um, so I was all garlic bread, breaded. Um, Ooh, garlic bread. Ooh. Some, oh, mate. Um, so normally what I tend to do is uh, I I make a spaghetti bolognese from complete from scratch, as you should. Mm, Never delicious. buy store store um, store stuff, store bought stuff. And the garlic bread, I normally get garlic bread slices. Then I add olive oil to it. Then I crack some um, salt over the top. Not massive amount just big um you know the, like the salt you would find on a good steak the big chunks yeah. just a few of those sprinkled across and it elevates garlic bread beyond belief and do you guys if you've got if you've got garlic bread slices rather than the actual full baguette if you've got slices do them mm. under the grill game changer do them under the grill not in the oven St right Storeboard never compares to homemade, says Rick. Hundred percent. Yep. Hundred percent. How are you? How are you doing? How are you doing? Apart from that, sir. Yeah, not too bad. Uh, it was a bit of a weird night's sleep last night, but yeah, all good. Um, Sounds good. I can't remember what was going on. We were right. So. TV or watching something last night. How about yourself? Doing good. It was good to see the family, and uh, Rick pointed mm -hmm. out that I was that, that I'm shaving. I, I, granted, I, I I've been shaving for pff, two or three days now. <laughs> yeah. Played some Final Fantasy VII this morning to get some uh, recording done for you guys in February, which will be premiering on the gaming channel. So FF7 will be premiering uh, as of the first of February. Uh, one episode per day uh, until the release of FF7 Rebirth. Now, we'll be streaming FF7 Rebirth nice. when it comes out, so I'm looking forward to that. Sounds good. Other than that, um, well, saw family this uh, afternoon, went to to get, get some uh, Croatian food, like some Croatian cuisine that was absolutely fucking delicious. Yeah, yeah I'm cr pretty full from that one still, so no hunger for me for the next couple of hours, so that's good. Yeah, other than that, living the dream, man, living the dream. Cool, happy days. Made my own garlic bread from scratch and used the top quality butter. Mmm. Oh, okay, so. oh, yes. Oh, you've, 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 if, you, if you've got the time, um, you should 100%. make everything from scratch. You should make everything from scratch. There's just should. no competition. There's just no competition for it. There's nothing Nothing compared to the homemade no. stuff. 
really. No, it doesn't. There's just no way. But it's yes, we are all good. We are good. Yes. And there are four or four. Hail to you, my dude. Hail to you. Can you guys hear me okay? Mm. Chat, can you hear me? Like, can you hear me okay? So I adjusted calm, the yeah. uh, I adjusted the microphone a little bit, so hopefully you guys can hear me a lot better now. Yeah, I hope I hope it does make a difference. Volumes ever so slightly. Yeah. I need to bump cool you beans. down I like by five percent, but that's fine. That's nothing to worry about. Yeah, that's that's generally yep. what I tend to do is just make sure we're both floating in the yellow. Yeah, and that's that's a good show. As, as long as we're both floating in the yellow, it's fine. It's it's actually fairly close at that point. Um, cool. Did I actually want to come to right. this place? Where, where in the hell are you right now, anyway? Um, I am in... Are you in Kugani? Um, Othard. I'm not in Kugani at the minute. Um, so Kug Join me for Kugani. I've got the call as the main quest, but I've got a Monster Hunter quest that I want to maybe do with you later. So it would be cool if you could okay. come to Kugani real quick. Yep, stand by. Because there is actually, actually an NPC where I'm standing, or should be. There's like a plus quest. It's called the uh, the New King on the Block. Yep. Stand by, stand by. Teleporting, teleporting to Kugani. Uh, I also reached a milestone today. Low, but game volume is low in fights, we'll be fine. Cool. Um, I also had a, wee, wee, a little milestone on the gaming channel today. My 100th video just went live earlier this morning. So, I've got 100 videos on the gaming channel now. Fucking insane. Congratulations, my friend. I have no idea how I managed to do 100 videos, but <laughs> there you go. Congratulations, uh, my dude. And we got Jack Tardad in chat as hey, well. Hey, Jack. Uh, I'm doing good, mate. How you doing? How you doing? Um, so just, just so that people are not surprised, um, I here, jumped Thanks. on to help steal Leg of History, and we've actually managed to change his name in his account. So we will come across as Steel Leg. So you will actually see Steel Leg in his Twitter, oh. his tweets to everybody. So is he, he's not uh, the uh, a good old name that he is usually is on Twitter. Correct. Ah, gotcha. So that explains the name change. I was like, huh? Okay, I wonder how that happened. <laughs> Yeah, Tombi happened. Tombi happened, of course. Tech support Tombi. Yes. Tech support Tombi. A little, a little heads up for you guys, by the way. Um, tomorrow morning around 10 o'clock my time, which is probably going to be in the middle of the fucking night for most Americans. But tough shit. Time zones. Um, I'm going to be yeah. playing Baldur's Gate. Because I realized it has been two weeks since I last played it. <laughs> um, that's fuck your pronouns, but it's now fuck your time zones. Um, um, basically, whereabouts yes. in Kugani? Um, the Bokairo Inn. Yep, teleporting. Roger. Uh, why didn't I get an alert on a new video? Rick says to Smoothie DJ. Um, where? On the gaming channel? I have no idea. That must have been, uh, that must have been a YouTube thing, because I definitely, uh, warned people in advance that I post will post a video. It's a very short one as well, it's not a long one. It's one of the uh, Grand Blue Fantasy videos. It's gonna be yeah. Bell End of History. Yes. yes. <laughs> fucking Bell End of History. I see you. That's so funny. Party Hunter. Is that the one? Uh, um, I think it. Yeah, I think that might be the one. Uh, oh. New King on the Block. The yes, that's the one. Unbridled enthusiasm. Nice. Yes. Let's do it. Cool. He's now coming across as Bell End of History. Yes, he is. Cool. You you will be encountering a uh, Palico. You know you know those cat creatures from Monster Hunter. Uh, so don't be uh, surprised yeah. later on if you see a random cat creature with a shovel coming towards you. So that's that's that. Okay, cool. Right. I'm so nice. we got that nailed down. So once we're done with the main main story quest shite here, uh, I thought we might wind down with a bit of monster hunting. So I would I would suggest we go to reunion and then do the quest the call. Cause I think that's yep. where we 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 last left off. I think right. Yeah, that's that's where I literally was. Um, you know when you um, said whereabouts are you come to Cardi? I was like at the call, doodah. Ah, gotcha. It matters because um, if you go to the top base, I can't mm. fly there, so you can't actually get down. No, I can I can see how we get down from it. To be honest. 
I'm I'm uh, going. I'm heading off, uh, uh, off from uh, where we are right now because that's probably the easiest way to go. Can I fly? That's my. Oh yeah, I can actually fly there. <laughs> yeah. See, I can't. I can't fly there yet. I don't, I don't even see you in the map. What the fuck's going on? Uh, it's because I'm in the HUD. I'm still in Kugani at the minute. I'm just sorting my HUD out. Each ah. Each. Yeah, but, but even even when you arrived and Kugani walked towards me, I didn't even see you coming in until like like very closely. It was yeah, it was yeah. a bit weird. Right. Oh, he's in chat. How you doing, hey, buddy? Hey, 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 hey. Um, right, so remember to feed my chicky. Yeah. There you go. Oh, I do actually have a quest here. Oh yeah. Oh, actually, the um. That's the weird. Monster Rick. hunter quest is here. It's literally right where we just landed. Oh yeah, 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 you have to talk to the NPCs here, because they oh, will tell right. you to go to a certain location in a moment, which is in the yeah. northwest of the map. Gotcha, gotcha. You, you, oh, you'll CLS see it. CLS brought you here. CLS, how you doing, buddy? CLS in chat. CLS. Oh, see him. Don't see him CLS on my end. CLS but... studio. No, I can't, I can't see him in mine. But welcome, my friends. Welcome. So, yeah, normally Final Fantasy, World of Warcraft, all the other games that I can think of. Yes, um, I did actually pick up Power World. Um, so I, <laughs> did I, you know? I bought Power World for me. Um, got got it installed for Tam as well. Because I was nice. curious to see if uh, Tam would be interested in obviously playing a different game as well every now and again. So <laughs> Has Tam actually ever Pokemon. played a Pokemon game before? Just out of curiosity. No. No, no, no not okay. really. Okay. I mean, yeah. granted, Power World is not really Pokemon, is it? It's, it's just no, a rip-off of it, but... It, it is what it is. It's yeah. it's Pokemon with guns, but we can't call them Pokemon. And all of the Pokemon <clears throat> have just got to have subtle changes. So mm. there's no copyright infringement on the views and the looks. I call it Pokemon Please Don't Sue Edition. <laughs> yes. <laughs> That's oh, pretty much... What? Actually, two seconds. I'm making a note of that name. Because <laughs> that's fucking amazing. I think I brought that up when uh, X-Ray played it the other day, and she she got a good laugh about that one. Yeah, I'm almost tempted. Um, yeah, you, you can use it. I have no copyright on that fucking name anyway, so. Pokemon don't sue edition. Please don't sue. Don't don't forget uh, the please. I'm not even going for the please. Fuck them. Um, Pokemon don't <laughs> sue edition. <laughs> <laughs> kind of like roll, roll, don't sue up into one word, um, mm. and it's S U instead, and everyone's gonna be like, oh, that's a weird name for it, until you, you actually read it properly. Anyway, yes, sir. Uh, nice. Where's your? Have you not got a two seat amount yet? For fuck's sake, man. Nah, I'm too. I've, wait, hang on. I right. might actually. Hang on, actually, I might have one. Hang on. Actually, do you know uh, what I'm is what's, what's that? Where the ether. Hang on, is, isn't Midgar Summer a two a two people mount? Uh, yes, yeah, yeah. Hang on, well, let me get Midgar Summer out. He's a two people mount, right? Can you get get on yes. on on? Yes. Right, Escape. Oh no, he's not. He's not. Oh, that's okay. okay. Wait, hang on. Uh, Ooh. who else do I have? I have. Oh, How you doing, my brother? How you doing, fella? Yol is not a two-person oh. mount, right? I have no idea. The only the only ones I know of are what's it called? Um, Batmobile. Batmobile. And yeah, yeah. The whales. <coughs> uh, but bend over, gifting one Tombi membership. Nice. Hi, Ben. By the way. To the Good one to see you, man. Jay Tapier over on Nerd Takes. Jay Tapier. How, How you doing? Uh, Rick, nice. I know why Tombi took a nap. He was on a stream with Kara, X-Ray, Go, and Az at 3 a.m. UK time. Did you play yeah, with them last maybe. night? No, oh, I was man. watching. Um, what was I doing right, last okay. night? I was fucking around doing shorts. So I was doing, uh, I was doing video editing and um, shorts and things like that. Mm -hmm. And next thing you know, it's uh, three o'clock in the morning. Uh, so I went to bed. Yeah, that's and that's on watching them there. And that's the become my life lately. Editing until yeah. like stupid o'clock in the morning, then having the video yeah. render. Yep. Who the fuck's that big yep. bastard over here? Mahishazu uh, 65. I mean, he's a fate as well. Want to kill him? 
Yeah. <laughs> let's go. Let's go. Fuck him. <laughs> I like the way we just both like yeah, should we just fuck, fuck him. him in the face. Fuck a fist. Fuck me, let's boy. go. Fuck the boy. Let's go, baby. I'm honestly quite shocked, by the way. You guys actually watched the long fucking video, uh, the the nine hour video. I was very fucking shocked about that. And it's actually doing reasonably well. <laughs> Do you know what? Do you know what? It is also fucking. Um, uh, OG, huh. you take care of yourself, man. Um, Later, man. Did I, did I miss cool. something? Did I miss something? Don't think so. Uh, so let's go in here. Interesting. All right. Mm -hmm. I think I've, I think I've missed a. Where's that big bastard not taking any damage? Big guy's um, not taking any damage, is he? He is. He is. He's just very, 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 very slow. slow. I'm uh, about to die. Fuck. Your health. Yeah, okay. I'm dead. Oh. Yeah, I can't even cast on you. That's fine. I'll, I'll Run, just. Let's sink my level. <laughs> Weird that. Uh, well, we'll fuck him up later then. <clears throat> yeah. That's fine. Yeah. There's literally a person in here in in the camp with a clan named Trans. Oh, great. Great. Fuck off. Fuck off, game. Fuck off, film. Fuck off, film. Right, where in the hell are you right now? Oh yeah, you're probably uh, near the fate, right? Yeah, or are you flying just, towards uh, the quest? North and, no, I'm oh, just yeah. north of the fate. Oh, I see you, I see you, yeah. Just come in, come on, come on. Got my, my trusty wolfie with me. There you go. Come a, come a, come a chameleon. Yes. Um, yeah, I, shall I tell you what's really weird? Right, okay, huh. so there was, a, there was a random tweet, some arsehole fishing for... Um, fucking views and uh, pitching for huh. interactions and things like that. Yeah. Uh, so he, he said, name one thing um, greater than diversity. And I put authenticity back on <laughs> January the 8th. At, Ooh. On, basically, up until yesterday, this one comment had about 5,000 impressions. So, not much. Hmm. Since yesterday, it exploded. It's now at about 21,000. It's wow. gone fucking crazy. And it's just keep on going up. To keep on going up and up and up. Fuck knows what's happened. But all <laughs> of a sudden, like, all the bots in the world have just jumped on this one um, this one tweet. It's fucking weird as fuck. I'm still going Ooh. up all the time. But uh, Ben, thank you very much indeed for that gifted sub. You're far too You're kind. You're a star, man. Thanks, far thanks too Ben. Kind. Um, okay. The you looking for the Palico still? <clears throat> Am I looking for the Wawa? The uh, oh, we're going for the quest. Okay, gotcha. Never mind. I thought I thought you were going for the Monster Hunter quest real quick, but never mind that. No, the Monster Hunter Whee! quest is in the opposite direction. Nice. Push. Just landed. Da -da -da -da. Oh, oh, please don't tell that. me that's another solo quest because I'm going to lose my shit if that's, if that's the case. <laughs> that was epic. I tell you, that was fucking epic. Um, Nani? Nani? Nani. Uh, yes, Blurps uh, are active on YouTube and Twitch. So and Blurps will be active as of tomorrow for me. <laughs> nice. Yes. Heretical nerd, God save us from the pretentious wankers that are modern game devs. Oh, oh. mate, the Indiana Jones one. Fuck my face. That guy just needs... If, if that guy was here right now, I'd kick him off this ledge. I'd just kick him off. Sparta kick him, yeah. Yeah, um, this is, this is Sparta. You know, I did I a... a... I've got the Baldur's Gate 3 Cup of Love from Angelo Frederick. Thank you very much. Hey. Uh, good stuff, good stuff. <clears throat> right, uh, let's see. Speak with Alize in Kian Khan, which is... Oh god. It's uh, in Namai. Okay, oh, that's, that's okay. A lot of teleporting, but that's fine. So I did a little uh, s little um, statistic on because I was timestamping the last video. So yes. we spent I spent about an hour and a half f t trying to fight Lakshmi mm -hmm. until like two, two, one hour and 20 minutes in. I realized like, fuck it, I'm just going to go on very easy and beat her that way. So I did yep. that. And the final battle that we did on the stream before we decided to fuck off um, took me two and a half hours nearly. Yeah. 
I didn't realize the time was passing that quickly. Mate, honestly, um, the the last fight that we had. Oh, I can fly here! Yay! Yeah, I was just about to say you, you can actually fly here. <laughs> yeah, I was fucking thinking I'm grounded just per permanently. Mm. Um, yeah, that last that last set of bosses, the mm -hmm. the difficulty was the fact that they tied the two fights together. So if you failed one. Yep. Completely reset. So that pissed me off a little bit. <laughs> which had a hard difficulty anyway, because yep. of the it was a DPS check. That final round was a DPS check. It, it was, yeah. Another round, which is a <clears throat> um, basically, can you avoid the shit and do DPS check at the same time? It just made no sense. Absolutely no sense. Um, heretical nerd. I was thinking the Hellblade two twits. Oh well, yeah. I mean, there's, there's so many, so many examples nowadays, though. Pete, I'll so tell many. you what, I'm, I'm, I'm looking forward to Hellblade Two, but I'm also very cautious about that game. Hellblade One was good. I really enjoyed that game, especially when you have headphones on, play it because it has some of the best sound design I've seen in quite some time in a video game. However, look it in, it, yay! Look it in, yay! Well, some people found your new emo then. I say it. Um, no, it was Rick just typed it. But yes, oh. um, that was on Toby your side. Toby has a new actually. emote. Yeah, I just noticed. <laughs> so in, in my chat, there is a new emote for those members. Yep, um, I will add that as well. <laughs> Soonish. <laughs> I'm just spamming it. Oh, Look at you, yeah. Yeah, I stole it from the from the, uh, the Nerdrotic channel, actually. <laughs> but considering that we're all a big, massive fellowship, uh, it's, it's fine. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. I've got lock it in. Yeah, he's flying around my screen right now. Yay! Lock it in. Yeah. I've been expecting you. Put steel legs on it. Lock it in. Yay! <laughs> I'm completely cautious about every game, every damn game these days. Yep. Yeah. You have to. You don't want to um, be in this false situ, <laughs> false pretense. That a game is yep. actually going to be good. Because yep. you can't fucking. You, there's absolutely no way you're going to be able to tell. Nope. I mean, we nope. all looked at Final Fantasy 16 was going to be amazing, and whilst it was a good, it was a white game. It was wasn't anything. It had to its issues, but it's good. About. Yeah, it, it didn't have anything to write home about though. It didn't have anything that stand out ish. See the thing. The thing the with visuals and sound. Yep. Um, that I would say. Do you know what? I could have skipped that one and just gone on to the next one, and I wouldn't be bothered. See, really wouldn't have been bothered. you you could have called the game something different than Final Fantasy sixteen, honestly. I would have called it Final Fantasy a Dark Souls Don't Sewers. Devil May Fant Devil May Fantasy, because it's yeah. essentially a Devil May Cry game, it is. just without Dante. <laughs> without Dante, yeah. Ah, uh, Rick says, I will never surrender my shekels to fun boat crap. Yes, never, exactly. never give up your shekels. Or your Rule number up. one, don't pre-order. Don't pre-order. Yeah, uh, I mean, the thing is, the, the whole pre-order has got its... The whole idea of pre-ordering has got its issues. You yep. really don't want to be pre-ordering. Oh, I've got a funny story about that, by the way. The about pre-ordering. I've got a very funny story about that one. Yeah. Um, you guys probably remember when a little game called Uncharted 4 came out. I actually had a pre-order because I, I was uh, very enjoying the, very, the the first three games. So I actually went out of my way to pre-order it. I know, I know, no pre-orders pre and all that jazz. But here's the kicker. I actually pre-ordered the deluxe edition of the game because I wanted the Nathan Drake statue that was in, in the collector's edition. Yeah. So I pre-ordered it at GameStop. I actually paid, paid it up in full, so it was paid for. Suddenly, you get a call from the local store manager of my of my city, saying like, "Hey, um, we have some other people wanting the collector's edition. Would you step off your pre-order and give someone else the pre-order?" I was like, "Fuck no, I'm not gonna do that." Why? Why should you? Yeah, exactly. I was like, "I fucking paid for this. I'm not gonna step up, step away from that pre-order now." The, right. Okay. I'll, I'll let you into a little secret with this one. Uh, Bombhead Brian, evening folks, I have discovered that I've been hey, gifted a membership two days ago. Hey! Very much indeed for my benefactor. Welcome, Bombhead Good to Brian. see you, Brian. Right. Good so, to see you. So, coming, coming back to that. So, mm. client, uh, so stores like GameStop and all this, that and the other, 
Mm -hmm. They have got no rights to phone you up. What I reckon's happened, it's not another customer, it's a member of the staff. Yep, that's what I was it's thinking. A member of the staff that's done that. They said, yep. oh, we want it, let's ring around and see if anyone will give it up. Yep. The other thing, to also just um, take a step back and, and look at the bigger picture, guys. When you pre-order, you're essentially paying for a product that's not yet ready, not yet developed, uh, and you can't even touch it. Yep. Think of all of that in interest that's being accrued on all of that pre-order money if mm. people are ordering it, like, say, a year in advance, which is what used to happen with World of Warcraft. Yep. Think of all that interest that they've earned for nothing. They've all the PlayStation 2 games that, that used to come out. Yep. They've done nothing to earn it whatsoever. It's mm -hmm. just free money. And that's why they do it. That's why they do it. So never pre-order, order your game the day it comes out. You're not yes, what I'm out. doing with Final Fantasy, because I'm not going to miss out. Miss out. Nope. I mean, the thing is, is that the collector's edition of Final Fantasy 16, I ordered the day before it was the day before it came out. And I literally probably got the one of the few remaining ones in Europe. Wow. I, able, I was still able to get it. I was still able to get it. It's the same with um, freaking with um, what's it called again? The PS5. I couldn't get it in Germany, so I actually ordered it from Amazon UK. And luckily enough, I got the last remaining PS5 from the first batch that was released in the UK. I was very fucking lucky with that one. I mean, granted, in hindsight, I could have waited until uh, until like months later because. Let's face it, um, the PlayStation 5 barely had any games when it came out. <laughs> yep. So, yeah. Where's the Maelstrom command? What the fuck is that? Uh, it's Aft Castle. Aft Castle, okay. Yeah, yeah. figures. It's, it's um, my, that's where my... your grand company is. Yeah. Yeah. What I think will happen soon is anyone who opposes woke culture will have the PlayStation treatment with the online library they purchased being delisted. Uh, yeah, I can see that. I can see that. Or you being refused services at banks and all that stuff. I could see that happening. Yeah. Oh, or they bumping down or bumping down your credit score or some shit. There'll be some, so, something there'll like be that something will happen. With, uh, punishment. I mean. Um, look at Nigel Farage in the UK. He had his bank account shut down for no other reason because of the way he um, votes politically. Yeah. Uh, my God, that fucking kicked off a hornet's nest. Matt Damon. Damn right. Damn right. Fucking Nat West should be fucking taken right wrapped over the coals over it. They should fucking be suited fucking into fucking oblivion for that. Yeah, flog them to death. They've got absolutely no reason to uh, affect it. Banks are supposed to be those institutions that we can all trust. And if we can't trust the banks, then well, the there's no one we can trust apart from ourselves. In the fellowship. Mm. Back to more fucking donuts. Fucking cunts. Matt Damon. <laughs> so Jack um, put, saying it in a chance, I was like, yeah. Yeah, that Indiana Jones game is going to be a fucking doozy, by the way. I mean, it's made by the guys who made Wolfenstein, the new new uh, trilogy, or the new two games that came out. Uh, fuck the third game. Um, Quick, question. Quick question. Just mm -hmm. hold on to that thought. Yeah. Um, have you... Um, burr, burr, burr. Right, okay. The next time we teleport anywhere, mm -hmm. keep an eye on my stream. Yeah, do you have a new... Di oh, yeah. Yeah, I see it. I see it. That's you cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's nice. see. That's phenomenal. It's lovely. It looks great. It looks great. It looks it's the concept great. arts of this of the cities, isn't it? Yeah. And that's from the uh, <laughs> things that can't be mentioned. Oh, the special tools. Yeah, gotcha. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> yes, yeah. we are all special tools. Special. We're all very special, guys. Where the fuck is this quest? It's in Rising Stones, mate. We have to go back to more donuts, go into the seventh heaven bar, and then. Ooh, it was there's really a throne room. Oh, obviously, it's across the road from Rising Stones. It's, it's in the Rising Stones. It's within yeah. the pub. And it's because the pub goes underneath. It's like. Uh, Holy shit, Xenos is still alive? The popular 
Huh? Shouldn't be. Now is the time to bring he, he, is a, he is literally in the cutscene right now. Unless... No. Uh, I think there's some dark, dark magic shit going on. <laughs> is there dark magic shit or the fact that we did some stuff ahead of where we what we should have done in the sequence? No, no. This is literally the sequence in order. That's fucked. Yeah, I know Xenos is coming back because uh, some concept art spoiled me on Shadowbringers. <laughs> yeah. Wait. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a problem. Fucking Fala concept say. arts, dudes. Fala say, you're so She's at her wit's end. Matoya's cave. What the, what the hell on earth is that? Do you know Alice is so short, comparative to me, she might as well be a dick adaption. Just bolt her on and say, go for it. Yeah. Anyway. Uh, uh, well, we, oh, we have to go to Idleshear. Ooh, haven't been there for a while. <laughs> Snort. Matuya. Matuya, Matuya's cave. Do you want I to go like there? I the, the concept art between the teleports. It's, also, it's, it's pretty crazy. fucking cool. Yeah. It's really good. I, I, I actually like that. It's really, yeah, cool. it's really, really nice change. As soon as, Dark as soon elf as magic. Time, yes. As soon as it came up, I was like, I don't recall that ever coming up before. I, I remember you met in Mirrodin talking about it before we went off air, though. I do remember that. My brain mm -hmm. doesn't fucking work some of these days, though, guys. Are you taking the plus quest over there, or are you, or are you looking for the way out? I'm looking for the way out, mate. <laughs> That's fucking. I was, I was like, what the fuck are you doing over there? <laughs> heading towards the heading towards the out. Or what? Uh, hang on, I'll, I'll come towards you. That's all right. It's all right. I, I, I can see where it is now. I can see. I'm a fucking idiot. I keep on remembering that the uh, red arrows are usually a good indication of of a way of getting out. Kinda, right? yeah. Uh, is it going to be left or is it going to be right? Left. Dark F magic. Yep, that's what. That's it. Dark F magic. I want to. I want to punch. I want to punch Samuel in J Jackson in the face for that. For that line. Uh, I want, I want there to be an echo equivalent of deaf girl magic, but spoken by a deaf person, so it has that kind of like deaf girl magic. <laughs> deaf girl magic. Deaf girl magic. You mean like you know? Uh, you mean how they spoke in the uh, in the TV show? Yes. See, that that really that really pissed me off. By the way, that they they would do the sign language thing, and then they were they were talking like fucking retards at the same time. I was like, guys, you can speak normally for crying out loud. It's one or the other. It's one or the other. Yep. Don't do both. Never go for yeah. retard. Yeah, either either talk and then do the sign language, or just put the fucking subtitles up. Yep. But then again, right. I'm right. expecting yeah. a bit too much from yeah. Disney Marvel. How you guys do? Exactly. Yeah, I mean, don't expect too much from Disney Marvel or no, uh, of course Disney not. Star Wars or uh, Disney. Disney Disney Disneyland. Yeah. Disneyland anymore. Disney. Oh. Oh wait, I just realized the bridge is broken. Fuck. Um. Uh, okay. Gay. Never mind that then. Okay. Um. Let's go left. Can we go left? Um. I think so. Right. I, oh, I can't fly uh, here. Fuck. No, can't fly. I'm uh, looking at the, the caveways. By the way, Brian, since you're in Tombi's chat um, and you've been uh, paying attention to my Baldur's Gate playthrough, I will be streaming a new episode tomorrow. So keep your eyes peeled on this channel right here. It might might be in the middle of the bloody night for you, so uh, just keep, just keep that in mind. But I will be. Uh, up in the early hours of my of my morning, yep. so you guys get a new episode. Because I'm itching to get that um, what's that world called again with the mushroom freaks? Was it the dark? Uh, the under under uh, the underdark the underdark. underdark. Get that underdark quest going. Because I realized I was dilly dallying a little bit too much in the last stream, so I want to make up for that one. <laughs> but the, the more you know, so good. Now that we got that sorted, wee, let's go. Hey, it's such a good game, though. It's just oh, I'm crazy. I'm still, I'm still blown away that 50% of Baldur's Gate players haven't played, finished Act One, though. <laughs> that, that still blows my mind. It's crazy. It's, I just really can't understand 
how people I would, got around it. I would love to know which which, which version of the um, game has the, so many people way. not finishing uh, Act 1, going though. Way, uh, yeah, I know. It's, it's fucking I, would... I mean, the, myself and Nina, we specifically looked at the map and basically chopped it up and made sure everything was done and all the quests were done in sequence and that there was no issues. Where's the fucking door? I'm trying to figure out where the fuck this is actually actually going right now. This well, we need to be up that ledge, but I can't see the. I can't see oh the wait, hang on. I think. Up. Hang on. I think I. I think I see where. Hmm. Let's see. It's trying to be a window licker for a second. Uh, let's see here. Let's jump over here. Okay, there's an invisible wall here, so fuck that. Okay. Um, bum bum bum. I'm trying to think where. There's no teleporter near that place, right? Nope. Okay. Um, I'm guessing. Maybe. Let's return to where we were before. I'm, ass I'm assuming something right now. Hang on. Oh. Uh, I um, think I'm. I uh, think I'm. I know where. It's us being retarded. We don't have huh? to go up. It's underneath. Or oh, is it in the cave, is it? Yeah, it's in the Progo Frog Cave. Mmm. Okay, it's just being fucking retarded. You alright, buddy? How are you doing? OT. Yeah, see you less. Uh, so what happened is my name was changed because of a chat where we were changing it as a joke. But it won't let me change it back until 14 days are up. Ah, mm. uh, OT gotcha. channel is my friend, and he didn't come. Uh, lol, it's me, CLS. Ah, it's oh, so heck. good. It's so good. Yeah, I've uh, fallen foul of the you can't change your name too often kind of stuff on my um, private account. Kind of annoying, isn't it? Yeah, fucking just no need for it. Just at the end of the day, if you want to change your bloody name. <laughs> As many times as I would love to know who uh, who on Twitter decided that it's a good idea to take the blue check mark away from you when you change your name. I wonder whose idea yeah, that was. For 24 hours. It's fucking retarded. 24 hours. Because it took them a week to uh, review my name change. Mm. And I'm like, so, but I even, didn't change my name. All I did was change an, uh, changed the value in my account, but that triggered the complete um, check. I'm like, it's the same with um, if you change your profile right. picture. It goes quicker to get your blue check back when you have your profile picture changed, compared to you know a uh, friggin' um, what's it called again? Friggy, friggy. Uh, friggin' change your name. Yeah. It's kind of weird that, but yeah, you can't really do much about that. I'm, I'm afraid. Yeah, There's a, a bit of fucking ball sucking going on. I think it was because of all the trolling that was going on. But then again, uh, I don't okay, fucking know. I will get him and his army of YouTubers to come visit your channel, Dobby. Yeah, don't oh forget Smoo as well. Just don't forget Smoo as well. All are welcome. Uh, like mm -hmm. like we yeah. always say, Celeste, you guys are what makes our mm -hmm. channels grow. Yep. Dead end. Fucking prison. Um, it's you guys that make our channels grow at the end of the day. Yep. And stuff like that, world of mail goes so far in goes a long way recommending people yeah goes so far in recommending uh, people's channels so thank you very much indeed any anybody who wants to turn around to their friends and say yeah just come just pop in come and see Tom B and Smooth they're a bunch of dicks uh, but they play well, games we are. they play games shit but well, they we are. play games shit you know what I mean um you know what by the way what's the, what's the plan for tomorrow by the way while I have you here are we still uh, playing FF, or you want to play something else for a change? <clears throat> I don't mind. Uh, I mean, we've we've got the option to play other games, and, and we've yeah. certainly got a few games where we could throw something in. Um, we've I got mean, uh, the Kingdom 80s. We've got Solasta. We've got quite a few. True. We can. We can. I don't have on. Kingdom 80s yet, but um, I was thinking. I don't know what time zone Peter's in, but maybe we can do some Left for Dead tomorrow. That sounds good. Uh, so Pete, we'll, let, we'll obviously heretical nerds in chat. Uh, if you're about tomorrow, uh, just let us know what your plans are tomorrow. 
Um, yeah. Just be aware that I would like to uh, play some games with the wife as well. Um, so yeah, that's, we'll, that's cool. We'll, if you want to play with the wife, that's fine too. I don't, I don't mind. I, I would play with the wife all day long, mate. Um, if you let me. Uh, <laughs> hey, oh. The thing is, the thing is, when you get to our age, you've got to understand that when you're married, you it just doesn't work. Uh, things just stop. Right. Um, um, I'm gonna teleport us into the um, dome and incli enclave directly. I'm not fucking yeah, flying across. I'm not, the yeah, yeah, yeah. I was just thinking that too. Yeah. The Doman and Glow. Rick, Rick, am I into? Me too. Uh, we would have have a punch a douche for charity booth with Samuel sitting there getting pum pummeled. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's punch a douche. Oh, That's punch a douche. It's, it's not yep. a dunk, dunk a clown or whatever those games are. It's punch a douche. Punch a cunt. <laughs> Honestly, uh, Rick, this should be the Tombi and Smooth Channel motto. Eat, play. You play shit rupees. Mm. Well, I mean, that's a yes. given, right? Yes. Yeah, hundred percent. Hundred percent. Don't forget coffee. <laughs> right. A defector's <laughs> tidings. Steel legs. Steel leg. Fuck me. Legion of Memers just just did a shout out for me. All I did was say hi. Mm, yeah, Marks so on the uh, Legion of Memers channel, by the way. Honestly, Steel Leg, you've got a very good opportunity here because you do have a good relationship and a good interaction with many, many, many big streamers, my friend. Take the mm -hmm. opportunity. Um, take the opportunity. Keep the comms going. Ask for shout outs or speak to the guys with regards to collaborations. Hey, play a game. Face. Have a chat for an hour. I'm sure that they'll all help you no matter what. Steel leg, yep. you're in a really good position, my friend. And, and that's but all much shout out to Legion of Mimas, by the way. Yeah, hundred percent. That's all you, by the way, because you built those relationships. Those yes. relationships take time; they take effort. So well done, mate. Yes. Well done. Uh, uh, Andy Matthews. Uh, hello, Mr. Matthews. I, I, I take it. You, that, <laughs> it it said hi on both chats. Mm. It says mm. hi over your side, and then Tomby says hi, Andy Matthews. And I can type nothing. It's fucking, fucking crazy. That's yeah, still yeah, something yeah. I need to get used to. That's something I still need to get used to. But, what, the auto oh, highs? The, the auto high, yeah. Oh, it's a dungeon. Hey. Can we join it together? That's the question. Probably, right? Yeah, it should be, actually. It shouldn't be any issues with joining it together. Robert, just, uh, just, just, oh. just, just, just say, I would like to... Just do a shout out in a super chat or member message or whatever. You don't have to feel weird about asking for shout outs, mate. Yeah, but the the other the other thing as well is that obviously, in fact, I'm gonna run my shout outs now that you've reminded me. So the shout my shout outs are going over to my Twitch, Blue Fry TV, to hey. YouTube. But the what? How how do you feel about the etiquette of having a super chat that says? Uh, come join my channel. I'm doing this, that, and the other X, Y, Z, A, B, C kind of thing. What do you think of that from a etiquette position? I mean, granted, you take attention away from the channel that you're sending the super chat to a little bit. Yep. But at the same time, it's free advertisement for your channel. There's yep. channels that are pretty cool with that kind of stuff. Then there's other channels who are not very cool about that. You, you have to... You have to consider the rules of the of the channel in a way because there are there are channels who have the rule no self promotion in chat. Yeah, I've seen that. Yeah. I've seen that happening. I generally don't have a problem with it, as long as it's not uh, reaching the lines of spam. Yeah, see the see the thing is on our channels, um, certainly for <laughs> mine, smooth probably along the same lines. If, Absolutely. If we know. If, if we know you and you just reach out and say, uh, do you mind just sticking my name in your auto um, follow macro y thing? I've got no problems with adding you to it. No, no, not not at all. With adding creators to we it. gladly got support no each problem. other. Yep, gladly. Got no problem with shouting people out. But it's also a two way street, guys. So yep. if, if you want me to do that for you, just do that for us. No problem at all. No That's a give and asked. take. It's a give and take situation. Right. Right. It's, it's, it's a two-way street. It, 
you can't you can't just expect someone to do shout outs for you constantly um, yep. and then not return the favors because i know someone who's like that and i'm starting to get a little bit fucking miffed with it <laughs> you want to tell me who it is nope it's, it's not me. There's no one in. It's no one in this chat. Let's put it this way. It's no one in this chat. It's no okay. one in these games that we're playing. Okay. Um, so it's. No Shoot, one me, a <laughs> Shoot me a DM no on Discord. Shoot me a DM on Discord. It's no one that ever comes into my chat. Let's put it that way. Oh. <laughs> okay. That narrows yeah. it down a little bit. Yep. <sighs> yeah, and, it, and it's and it's more of a frustration thing because. I think people are so naive to the fact that they're getting a lot of assistance and a lot of advertisement and they can't return the favors. Ah, oh, Ben Dover. Hello there. Hello there. Hello there. Ben Dover on your side, by the way. Am I, am I seeing your chat before you see it again? Yep. <laughs> I think that's fucking well funny. I'm sure Varys will say hello. Speak with the Alliance leaders. Look at this little midget. I just want to drop kick it. Let's see how far I can toss a dwarf. Let's see how far we can toss a dwarf. <laughs> and Ben gifted one membership to my channel. Thank you very much, Ben. Let's see yeah, who's the lucky winner. That's what I was talking about 30 seconds ago. Fuck you. <laughs> Honestly, <laughs> I can't understand why your chat doesn't come up as often as mine does. I don't I'm know. Like, it, it will come to him. I, I don't even have a delay on mine. Delay. Oh, and Rick yeah. got it. Oh, <laughs> well, that's that's fitting. Rick got it. Hey. Nice. nice. Thank you, Ben. Thank you very much, Ben. Thank you very much indeed. It is much appreciated, sir. Yep. It sounds suspiciously like a religion itself. Uh, Error says, I, I know who it is. <laughs> I, I can imagine who it is, yeah, but I'm not going mean, to say it. Is, is the thing is, is that, don't get me wrong, I've got a lot of time for people, but there's, there's just it's a give and take. There's it's just a give the and take. frustrations at times where I get calls. I mean, I've had calls at silly o'clock in the morning, do this, do that, do the other. And it's like, yeah. I think some of it sometimes just falls on deaf ears. <laughs> Literally. Not that I do anything for uh, mutual benefit directly. That's a give and take situation, mate. That's, like I said. Yeah. It's like you, you take uh, take a oh, finger and uh, they take the whole hand sometimes. It's a spit. That's, oh, yeah, that's, that's pretty much my my uh, my employ employer uh, that I work for in the hospital business. There's another kicker about that that whole situation, by the way. I actually got a message, a text message from one of my um, super supervisors asking me if I can come in a day after after I got off night shifts. I was like, I'm not in the city, so I know I'm not I'm not able to jump in. A day later, another 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 one of the supervisors that I work for gave me a text. Hey, we have so many people falling sick. Can you work this weekend? I'm like, no. I'm not. I can't. No. No. And even in the UK, there's actually a minimum number of hours that you have to have off before you can yep. actually do a day shift after a night. Yep. Yes, it's like seven or eight hours, I think, right? Something like that. It's a reasonable amount of hours you, you have to have. Rick's, I think. Rick's analogy there is so fucking funny. It's untrue. I'm ready to just piss myself with laughter. Some mm. folk need glass belly buttons to see where they are going. They are so yep. far up their own asses. Yup. Wait, it's amazing. That's amazing. They need sunglasses for their ass, their own ass cheeks because this uh, the sun shines through their ass cracks so much they don't even see where they're going. That's how bad Shapping. it is. Clapping cheeks. Hey. Are we in this solo by ourselves or? No, no. It's, it should be a thing that we can play do, do together. Um, because it's the face you, of war, right? You, yeah, but the thing is, I'm look, well, I'm watching you on your stream, and you're apparently right next to me. Um, 
But try to see if we can actually sign up for that one together. Yeah. Uh, face of war was it? Yeah, uh, face of war. So enter Gimlet Dark. Gimlet Dark. NPCs. Via duty or... support. Okay, let's see. Uh, where's duty? There you go. Uh, duty finder. Ooh. We are in Stormblood. Yep. What's that freaking place? Gimlet Dark, right? Yep. That's what I'm looking for. I found, I found it. Found okay. it. Yep. Yeah. I can't do it though because of your, your leader. Yeah, I'm just gonna promote you. There you go. Alright. Uh, join. You should be queued up now as well. Oh, yeah. I am indeed. We get 100 poetics for this one. 100. Nice. Yep. Happy with that. Happy with that. Yeah, that message that you just read from Rick disappeared in my fucking chat. <laughs> yeah, what's that about? I have no idea. It's Apparently your stream it, tool is it? cheating. <laughs> my stream tools. It must be my interwebs. It's so fast. In the future. I'll just open up YouTube Studio. Maybe that's quicker than my Streamlabs. Could be. Lock it yeah, in, my, yay. Lock it in, yay. Steel Legger History just went up another sub to 126. Congratulations. And this is the thing, Steel Legger. You are, you are onto a winner. Just keep on going. Keep on doing the games. Yep. Keep on playing. Keep on yep. shouting out the various different games you're playing. That's, we've sorted that's out how it works, the, mate. We've sorted out the play, play, um, Power World, uh, thumbnail now. So you've got that. So you've got your um, stuff booked in. Yep. Yeah, you're doing well, mate. You're doing well. Yeah, Keep he's doing pretty well. There Keep you going. go. So I've got the control room open now. My stream's Hiya. muted on studio. Hiya! Hiya! Oh, you're dude is taking, and you just taking quite some time to get um, mm. noticed, right? Yeah, less than five minutes. I'm sure I brought up some biscuits with me. I've got a nice cup of tea, and hey, a cup of tea is basically cold. I'm gonna have a laugh and see how many um, views this fucking thing's had now. Fucking Jesus. Let's yeah, I got some shorts lined up as well that I'm going to upload uh, sporadically throughout the week. <laughs> Looking forward to 20 that. 20,500. Nice. How are you guys doing, though? How are you guys doing? Oh, I guess. Just gonna get my gear fixed before we go into that instance. <laughs> and I need to eat some food. There you go. That'll do nicely. <laughs> 126 subs. Holy shit, Robert. Hmm? Yeah, he's doing well. Nice, yeah, doing pretty well. well. I'm see gonna it. run round jumping on stuff because the queue is shit. Yeah, I just left that area so I can actually walk around and mucking about with NPCs. <laughs> Seeing if I can jump onto the um, Palisade spikes. <laughs> um, oh, I can jump on these ones. Can I jump on the spears? Ooh. Don't oh, impair yourself. Mate. Oh, trying, I'm trying. I wanna jump onto <laughs> Hey, we're good. Yay. Commence. Some folk need rest. Yes, Engage. Light party. Lighter party. Obviously party. we don't know these fights at all. That looks like some World War One shit. Like we're in some kind of trenches. Okay. Let's go. I need to get my iron wheel out. There you go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. 
have no clue what the fuck's gonna happen, so just bear with me. At least we're on level 70, so that's good. Yeah, indeed. Hey. No se habla yeah, espanol. The, the, thing, the things that we add and can't talk about are awesome. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's just some of the icons and things like that that have gone straight. Mm. They're great. Make it really good. Nice. Like a different game. <laughs> oh, it just makes it pop. So nice. So nice. Uh, so, uh, who in chat has been doing something interesting today? Apart from obviously Steel Lakes because I've been watching your streams. But Snoo's been out for dinner with family, which is always good. Mm. Yes. What about anybody else? That's my obligatory family meet thing thing that I do. <laughs> I wonder if one of the mages will complain that I'm too small again, <laughs> like last time. <laughs> Probably. That'd be fucking funny, honestly. Yeah. Okay, yeah, look, what the fuck is going? I mean, this is literally World War One that we're doing here. Longest class times in the world. Is, is that you who summoned the dragon? No, not my dragon. I wish I could summon the dragon. I don't know where the dragon comes from, but the dragon's awesome. Looks cool. Yeah. I forgot Carbuncle in Final Fantasy VII re uh, re re uh, Remake, by the way, as a summon. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Tifa's got it, and it's pretty funny when she summons it, because it's just healing. And at the end of, of, of its cycle, it does the uh, diamond dust that Shiva usually does. It's pretty yeah. hilarious. Like, some of those spells... Are, I'll tell you what, that's one thing I will say about Final Fantasy XVI. The, um, the, the summons the icon, are ridiculous. Uh, Man. Fucking amazing. The icon battles are fucking great. Yeah, it's phenomenal. Fucking kaiju battles, dude. <laughs> yeah, because that's basically what it is. Um, <laughs> Phenomenal. Hype as fuck. <laughs> they were hype. Yeah, visually, it's just something else. Hey. Oh, we get 80 po uh, more po uh, uh, Allegan Tombstones for this one. Extra. Ooh, what's it? who's this giant bastard? Don't Come know. here, fucker. Don't know. Don't know. I'll just pull him again so he gets, gets off your backs. And he's doing the tank buster thing. Okay. Yeah, you do that. You do that. Fucking asshole. Boom! That's a good thing I casted that fucking spell I just did. Yep. Ow. Oh, he's doing a circular thing. Oh, okay, yeah. gotcha. Okay. That's trivial pursuit. <laughs> What's the subject? <laughs> Fun fantasy. How, how to dodge. How to dodge, yeah. Question number one. I mean, that's a given. I, the thing is, is that I actually had enough time then to look at the what the boss was going to do. And it was really clear from the spinning round. Well, it was kind of like intimated. That it was and your toenail around. cutting. What oh. the fuck? Brian, are you okay? Uh, okay, That's, that makes sense. Boop! 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 He's doing Simon Says <laughs> with punching. <laughs> Who's standing underneath him? <laughs> Who's trolling him? Why is the healer taking the, the what the fuck? No, it's, um, okay. it's a casted spell that we have to soak. So okay. When you see the when you see the big yellow ones with uh, arrows pointing inwards, we have to soak it so everyone just jumps in. Tanks should jump on it as well. Okay. Oh, we're doing good though. We're doing good. Yep. We are indeed. 
Well, we're doing comparatively better than the last, the last, 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 the last time we played him. <laughs> That's for yeah. sure. I mean, th those battles are not even cl the remotely difficult compared to what we did last uh, last time. Not even close. Well, I'm s I say that now, but I'm probably going to jinx that. <laughs> it's it's probably going to go really horribly wrong. It's going to fail like with like one percent. <laughs> That'd be sad and hilarious at the same time. I'm gonna be my back. I'm gonna pop over to Tommy's stream and drop my like. Hey, that's a good shout. Drop your likes, guys. Drop your licks and drop your subs. Fuck your face. Fuck your, hashtag fuck your face. Hmm. <laughs> you, should have, uh, you should have add that to every stream title. That hashtag FYF. And everybody, every time. Shower, actually. And then if, it's, if someone asks, like, what is FYF? You just say it then. <laughs> it's gotta, fuck your face. Right yep. You Come in fu and fuck off. Bam. Yep. Oh, bless you. Hey. And bend over with one more membership on my side. Brendan P! Hey! You actually saw that. That actually came up pretty quickly on your side. Yeah, that's because I'm not in studio as well. Yeah. I that's think that's why. Oh, uh, yeah, because studio is probably going to be introducing the 60 seconds or 30 seconds um, chat delay as well. Yeah, I think, I think it. I mean, my, mine's rather instantaneous so far, so it's not too bad. But it's a qu quicker than Streamlabs currently. And remember, I have barely any latency on my end. I think it's like one or two seconds. Tops. Yeah, I've, got, I've got fucking no latency on anything anymore. Not since going to uh, two separate one gig lines. Fucking best bonkers. Whoosh. What are, what are uploading 4K? Done. Want to do it in 1080p? It Interestingly, there's a lot of pugilist or mage uh, stuff that drops here. Pippin of the heart. Go Pippin, go! Go Pippin long stopping. On. Nice. It's pretty straightforward this one. I yeah, like that actually. I mean granted we have other people helping us as well so that makes it a lot yeah. easier. Unlike the qu the one quest we, where we were fighting uh, this crazy elite over oh, overpowered yeah. bint. Mary Sue edition. Mary Sue. Oh shit, they got Scorpion from Final Fantasy 7. Fine, it's <laughs> What's he doing here? That's, that's funny to see one of those here. Brace yourself. I'm just keeping an eye on the in game chat a little bit as well, so I'm not missing anything yeah, if, if I'm our teammates are saying something. Well. I haven't seen any messages come up. That's good. At least they're not cursing me out. <laughs> the thing is, we're not dying. We're not failing to mechanics. So what? What can they so, say, really? Yeah, that's, that, that's also true. Us. Uh, uh, greed. Oh God, Prometheus. <laughs> okay, let's come. Let's go, bitch. Come get beach. Angelic oh, no. Kitty <laughs> is our, is one of our healers. <laughs> Angelic Kitty. <laughs> Sounds like something else, but okay, we'll, we'll just leave it at that. <laughs> Angelic uh, Pussy. 
Huh? Huntington Stunt's going to report me for witchcraft and having two one gig lines. Yes. Oh boy. Yep. <laughs> the, so I've got two, two one gig lines coming in from different um, ISPs. Got my ass kicked there. Oops. Router aggregates both of them together. Um, okay. So one of them, one of them's clearly primary, the other one's secondary. If one goes down, it switches to the other automatically, um, so there's no uh, disruptions. But for the most part, both basically combine the bandwidth together. Mm -hmm. um, so yeah, the router goes fast and swift. And everything in the house is either on a two and a half gig or a ten gig line mm -hmm. um, internally within the house. So speed of speed of my network in my house. It's like, oh, are you using Wi-Fi? No, I'm using fiber optic cables between downstairs and upstairs, and then turn off the computer. <laughs> oh. Oh. Sorry. Right. Oh. Nope. oh. <laughs> no. Are, are you greedy? No, not really. I just, um, I just mm. prefer to, uh, put it in the center. Yep. Put in the center. Ooh, you fucking prick fuck. Ooh, you fucking punted me. <laughs> you yeah. fucking punted you, do it. Yeah. I'll just keep the boss's attention so you can get revived. No, what? that's alright. I've got the, I've got the res already. That's my own yeah. fucking not Not paying attention, <laughs> you mean? Yeah, I, was, I looked at a glance over to look at the chat. The beautiful chat. Well, I wouldn't necessarily say beautiful. Needs more people in it, snort. Needs Are you guys experiencing people. buffering oh. currently, uh, uh, guys? No, I can't see, can't see any uh, buffering. Uh, according, uh, according to my studio, it says, Error, YouTube is not receiving enough video to maintain smooth streaming. As such, viewers will experience buffering. The fuck? Okay. I'm not, I'm not seeing any buffering. That's weird. Now that being said, I am watching it. Oh, no, I'm not seeing any buffering. Mm. I don't see any buffering. Quit the tomfoolery, YouTube. I'm getting sick of it. The tomby foolery. The tomby foolery. Yeah, it's the tomby foolery. Stop it. Stop, Stop it. A rear guard, a scholar rear guard. Oh boy, if that's a butt sex joke. Then I don't know. Gadoosh. <laughs> Gadoosh. Okay, what was I gonna do? Fly. Okay, it's fine now. Do. YouTube uh, got the uh, stick out of his ass. Well, um, I'm gonna. Sw I have it in 720. Uh, yeah. Uh, but I'm going to switch it into 1080p and just keep an eye on it, mate. Yeah, yeah. Seems to be fine, though. That was just a brief warning, real quick. It seems to be fixed, though. Yeah, I mean, I can't seem to see anything wrong with it. Yep. Yeah. By the way, if, if you haven't already, guys, I'm uh, just going to do my round of shoutouts. Uh, please subscribe to uh, Inside All Day Podcast, if you can. They're, they're a bunch of lovely ladies who do a podcast together. It's also run by Nadia, who's a very close friend to the, to the channel. To both our channels, I should say. And um, also, um, do subscribe to Horror Amorata if you haven't already. She just got monetized recently, so I want to give her channel a little push as well. Nice. Horror, if you're wa watching on Twitter, you're welcome. <laughs> Inside our podcast, where bitches get stitches. Yes, sir. Yeah. They are fucking amazing. Mm -hmm. Amazing ladies, Absolutely and uh, amazing. well, I hope they get nerd cookies on for the Doom episode. Oh, they, I, yeah, I, was oh, I fucking hope they do. Really fucking good. I'm pretty sure Nadia's got it all sorted out already. I fucking love June. Helene is I good. Mean, She's really good. The June RT, um, real time strategy game I've got. Like the Spice Wars. Wars. You mean? Yeah. Isn't that free to play? No. No? Huh? Is it? Huh. Yeah. It's also on Game Pass, I think. Xbox Game Pass. Uh, could be. Or Microsoft Game Pass, or PC Game Pass, it should be. Games. I mean, no. I've had it a while, I just have not played it. Hmm. Oh. 
That's one. Let's go, baby. Hello. Hey, Luke. How's it going, sir? Hello. Hello. The man with a plan that can do things. <laughs> I love how we both went there. <laughs> how you doing, Luke? What you been up hey, to, Luke. buddy? What you been up to? Busy man. He's a busy man. Yeah, of course he is. He's a legend. What you been doing on this fine... I keep thinking it's Sunday. Yeah, it's same. Sunday. It's so many times I thought it was Sunday. I said to my parents, like, happy oh, Sunday to today, golfing. and I was like, what the fuck? Golfing. Ooh. Sculpting. Sculpt sculpting. Ooh. Get, you, sculpting. Get your fucking play and do fucking... Uh, what's that film with Patrick Swayze? Um, Ghost. Ghost? Yeah. Yeah, Rick, I, I fucking, um, I turned it on, and I thought, do you know what? This, this looks awesome, this game, and I was going to play it, and I can't remember what happened. I think it might have been the car that happened, and I just never got around to actually sticking on some streams and just playing some real-time strategy, just... RTS is so or... chill to play when you when you have nothing else to do. Yeah. It's pretty damn good. I recently played replayed StarCraft, the original. That was so good. Old you StarCraft, man. Time to get serious. All right. So not anymore. Go on, zombie. Leave these soldiers to us. No. No. <laughs> no. 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 There's a channel out there called EFAP no. Highlights that posts like uh, clips from EFAP, like uh, shorter versions of the uh, of certain events that happen within the EFAP streams. And there was a uh, recap of um, of uh, the 2020 New Year's Eve special from 2020 f f uh, 23 when uh, Duma rage quit the stream <laughs> when Mala called him out that, that there's no bad. No games that have no no storytelling going on. Because Duma was going on about not enjoy, uh, uh, not uh, wanting to enjoy games without story, and then Fringy rightfully said, "Like you know, there's vi visual storytelling in most games, right?" <laughs> that's the whole fucking point. They, that's all that there ever is in it. He's just there for the gameplay, he doesn't care for the story, that was his take. And obviously the EFAP crew uh, called him out on that shit. Ow, why am I gonna get my ass kicked? <laughs> Ow! Just a fucking dealer's trying to worry about me. Being Christ boy. almighty. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, 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 sweet child of mine. Jeez, mate. Yeah, it's fucking... You're getting rezzed, are you? Yep. Oh, fuck me. This is gonna get rough. Oh. Oh well, I'm still alive somehow. No idea why, but I am. Let's go. Let's go, bitches. Let's go, bitches. Let's kill this fucker. Kill this bitch. Kill the kill the bitch. Oh shit! I need to get the fuck away from you guys. <laughs> Whoop. And Julia is down. Let's drink some strength potion real quick. Impressive and eat some food. Let's fight Let's go. together. Alright. No, nope, you're not gonna do that, motherfucker. Oh shit, oh shit. There's some yeah, some watching, some cutting bullshit going on. Yeah, I was watching the bullshit lines. He's pulling a Virgil on us, yeah? From Devil yeah. May Cry. Show me your motivation. Fuck, a dick. fuck your face. Sport. Sport. Yeah, fucking damn right. Fucking crack. Hey, DSP's not doing the documentary anymore, by the way. He ducked out of it. <laughs> so, yeah. And he's banning people who do donate him super chats from Argentina now. Is he? Yep. Fucking prick. Imagine being so ungrateful that you, you do this kind of shit to your audience. That fucking twat could easily donate, like, free memberships to, uh, to, uh, to most, of, most of his viewers that are there. But nope, he snort. You wouldn't that because that. That takes money out of my pocket. I can't do that. Don't do that. Mm. Can I do that? I will. 
I will. I'll say. I'll say this. Right. Okay. So when it when it comes to the free membership, so every time I get the free membership top up, I'll mm -hmm. use that. Yep. I'll also Same. probably throw in another ten, maybe twenty memberships on top of that. Yep. As a thank you for as your continuous thing? support. Yeah. That goes without saying. <laughs> I mean, just, you guys are awesome. You, we wouldn't be doing this with, if it weren't for you. Hey, Psychotic Mongoose, what's up? Ah, oh, Psychotic Mongoose. The Mongoose. How you doing, my friend? Also, another crazy generous person. <laughs> psychotic Mongoose is crazy generous as well. I'm not just saying that because he's in chat right now, but he it really is. It seems we have no choice, Julia. What? We have to fight them at the same time. We should feel honored, savages. Few are they ha who have witnessed the tw the two, the twins. Okay. Uh, okay. Just 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 witness the twins. The Ow. The Ow. 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 Oh, this is gonna hurt. We were just in the vial when I was casting it. Where the one sits on the other one's shoulders. Mm -hmm. Ah, we will do choppy choppy together. Fuck him up. Fuck him up. Fuck him up. Fuck him up. Don't give a shit anymore. Fuck him up. Hey. Well played. Uh, well played. I'm getting a cold, but other than that, I'm okay. How are you? Oh, bless your heart. Oh, bless your man. Bless your heart, my dude. Rick Cleary, my, uh, my wife needs to feed at her pig trouble, so no Argentinian money. Big Macs don't grow on trees, snort. <laughs> snort. Snort. I did nothing wrong. I did everything correct. <laughs> Remember that. And my PC just wasn't good enough. Oh. No, he shocks me. I need three thousand dollars for a new PC. You gotta he, help me. Guys. If you if you really think about it, right, he gets like hundred, like eighty dollars per stream on average, right? Yes. Every fucking day, every fucking day. How can he every not day. afford a gaming PC? Well, Riddle me that. Well, Riddle you know, me that. That one's smooth. Yeah. We, that yeah, I know. He's a degenerate gambler. Yep. If he wouldn't piss that money away gambling, he would have enough money to buy a fucking PC. Alright, speak with Hori Boulder. That's what people call him in chess sometimes. <laughs> I mean, can't say I blame people for... Or, what was it? Akdorf Snortler, they call him sometimes. The, the detractors. He's alive right now. He's alive right now. I think he is. He might be, actually. I'm, I'm going to have a look. He's on the East Coast. He should be live right now. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go in and say, is this where I come for great... Um, for wanking material. For, for great <laughs> betting advice. <laughs> Financial advice. Remember, guys, he's got a business degree. He's got a business Only degree, guys. channel subscribers of 24 hours or longer can send messages. It's like... Boo. Sweaty man pi pixels don't pay for themselves. You know how much champion ho 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 horror. I'm almost I'm almost tempted to um. <laughs> if if I could talk in chat, mm -hmm. I would turn around and said I'm surprised your PC could fucking play this game. Well, he's playing on console, honestly. Yeah. What what, what is he playing right now? Power World. Uh, he's playing on Xbox, because yeah. it's on Game Pass. Because I'll, he doesn't have to fucking I'll pay for it. Yeah, I would turn around and say, um... um Get a fucking PC, um, you fucking yob. You bet in this game? Is there casinos? No. No, but okay. I think there's micro microtransactions being added into the game soon. As far as I'm concerned. At least. My Michael transactions, guys. <clears throat> Michael, Michael Knight, sweaty man pixels don't pay for themselves. Snort. You know how much champion ho... <laughs> Champion Hogan's nipples. I mean, yeah, I mean, he has to pull some Hulk Hogan's in his WWE Champions game every once in a while, guys. You're forgetting the most important part here. By the way, shout out to Hulk Hogan. He actually rescued a woman recently. Did he? Yeah, Nina talked about it on uh, Infinite Hope. 
the thing is, most wrestlers are actually decent individuals. I yeah. Mean, they're, they're, just, they're just stunt performers anyway. They're just entertainers. Speak with Maxima and North Silver here. Except for people like The Rock, who's a bit of a prick. He's a cunt. Fuck him. Yeah, he is a fucking prick. He don't be The prick. Rock, guys. If you want to be a good human, yeah. don't be The Rock. He'll stab you in the back faster than the fucking guy on bloody... Some fucking... He'll drop you quicker than a hot potato. Well... You were a bit of a hot potato. Let's chuck him. Let's chuck him. Uh, subscribe. Yeah, look. Subscribe to Mr. Porkchop here. Just Snort. Snort. I did nothing wrong. I did everything correct. Yeah, my shout-outs... So far, my shout-outs are probably a quarter of the way through. Mm-hmm. Goes on for fucking hours, uh, literally hours now, because I add everyone in there. In fact, cool. Can I, uh, yeah, I've added Luke. So I've added Luke. You're in my shout. Yeah, as well. he was. He was in. He was in the one from yesterday. Yeah. So he, he's in yeah. all of them. So when I get creators in the chat, same as yourselves. When we get creators in the chat, I'll add you to my shout auto shout out list. Your name will come up across Twitter. Will come up across YouTube. I'm looking at the code required. So I can fire it into kick and rumble at the same time, guys. So as soon as I've done that, um, I'll add that in and basically do all of it. Be amazing. Oh, we got a uh, another it's instance coming. It seems. Yeah. Accompany the resistance fighter to Alliance headquarters. Uh huh. I heard through the grapevine mm -hmm. that Mirden is a bit of a dick and that he should come on stream. I don't know how him. true that is. You never know. Oh. Um, precious recl reclamation. What the and fuck darkness is that? compels you. Oh, I didn't realize I had one to actually hand in right there. Hey. Business. Yes, hand in. Speak with Roban. Uh, yes, Rick Cleary, don't buy the rocks tequila. No more celebrity artificial flavor tequila crap. Oh, great. We have really? another. We got a quest coming that we have to do it separately. Yeah. There's, there's only a few alcohols, beverages, and beverages Bever that I would actually buy to drink from celebrities. Oh. You've got um, <clears throat> Ryan Reynolds' gin. Mm -hmm. I would That's drink a good that. one. Uh, I haven't tried it, but I would drink it to test it and then make my opinions. The um, power of darkness compels me, Yes. Dan Aykroyd's skull to test that. Oh, uh, I, he I heard Jontron talking about that in a video. <laughs> yep. That, that's kind of funny. Okay, so we got oh. the big bat coming. Who is it? Oh, oh look! Oh, look, oh, it's... Uh, compelled you. Mirden, summon thee to our side. Come on, you bitch. I wonder what he's doing, actually. What he's taking his shit, him? probably. <laughs> oh, I'm playing Hien. The hell? Why am I playing a Hien? The hell? I don't even know what quest you're fucking doing there. That's the, that's the main quest, mate. Oh, you must be ahead of me, then. Yeah, just, I, I just traveled ahead to the camp where we were in earlier. Yeah, but I'm playing as Hien all of a sudden. Nice. Are you ready? Yes. Are you ready? Tommy, you like what I tag you and smooth in. Well, the only pro the only problem with that at uh, the minute still is clearly I'm playing We're playing the game. fucking video game. <laughs> and so. I haven't really paid attention to Twitch Quack. These, these bloody kids and their fucking newfangled technologies and stuff. I know, right? Stopping. Let me refresh this Twitter while I'm trying to explode. We have a gallerism. Nice. Brace yourselves. Oh, look, he's here. You summoned him. No, but, but the thing is, you know full well that he's fucking lurking somewhere. <laughs> you know, I, was just, like, I was doing something else. I, think, I, only, I thought we were doing this tomorrow. I have no idea what we were doing or when we were doing it. Um, <laughs> but early the enough. Thing is, sure, surely. That wasn't that wasn't a deliberate um, 
need and get your ass on the game and come play with us kind of thing. Because um, obviously we're aware that you've got fucking other life, another life. How are no, you, no. sir? Fuck I'm this doing great. That's good. That's good to hear. That's good to hear, man. Oh. Are you guys enjoying the... Uh... No, uh, just playing some pally war. Oh, how, how are you finding it? A little confusing, but I'm enjoying it. Yeah. It seems awkwardly well, entertaining. I got, it in, <laughs> I got it in I installed it. Uh, so I was, I was thinking about playing that tomorrow. Yeah, uh, you can uh, like do... Tomorrow during a day kind of thing. You can do, um... Uh, multiplayer on that. Yes. And the good thing is, is that you can do a multiplayer um save and then obviously just disable the multiplayer and play it solo for a little bit yeah there's a lot of it's a lot it's a big learning curve there's a lot of stuff going on i had to reset once once already just to figure out what i was doing <laughs> i have no idea what i'm supposed to do right you got to i just say and then go up then You're using samurai abilities. Yeah. Yep, first time I'm using them. What is your Giri doing? Ah, uh, right, okay. Got you. Right, that, then that one again. Then for a third time, then I can use that to come. Ah, yes, I know all of this shit. It's coming. This feels right to me. This feels a lot like monks and warriors in World of Warcraft. Go fuck yourself, Xenos. I'm taking you guys are almost done with uh, Stormblood. Hey. Well, we want to get out, get through it after the the battle from last the last stream <laughs> with the almost two hour f boss fight. <laughs> that was my That was yeah, brutal. I was. That, that that stream fucking drained me by the way i was i was that that fucking physically and mentally tired from it i took a 10 hour nap after that semi haggers hawaiian rum ryan reynolds sort sort aviation gin oh did he i thought he, i thought he's still the owner again? of that company he sold it again that'd be weird I know he's cut down his prop, his, his percentage of ownership, but I didn't know he sold it entirely. Hmm. Um, it, that just looks like nothing more than a trap, Steel Leg. Oh, it's a trap. Basically, there's some woman with a fucking chunky, thick butt going down an escalator. And the other half has got like a hat on, then he's got glasses underneath it. Hello, he's my cool. lady. Hello, my darling. <laughs> Wobbly bum, wobbly bum. Wobbly bum, wobbly bum. Right, Zenos, you're gonna go down for real this time. What Fuck is you. Sorcery? The sorcery. Sorcery. Oh, you're doing the. You're being tied up. The monk place is now considered a congested world. Wow. What? I just I just transferred to the uh, world. Nice. nice. And it's, it's it's just popped up. It says it's a just a world, which is crazy to think about. Yeah. Bonk. What? Uh, you're on our rough room. So you're on the last thing before Shadowbringers. Nice. Looking forward to it. To it. Looking forward to it. I wasn't here for the dungeon. I've got the Monster Hunter quest uh, queued up for us because I want to beat Raffalo's ass. <laughs> I'm tempted, honestly. I, I want to. I want to beat Raffalo's. I've got a bone to pick with that fucking dragon. What she ever do to you? She's a bitch. Raffalo's is a bitch. She she ruined a lot of playthroughs from uh, from back in my Monster Hunter World days. Let's just put it that way. See my screen has changed a little bit maybe, because of things that we don't mention. <laughs> ah, you made it, you made it easier to uh, yeah to manage. 
the visual yeah, the visual the, aids the real, est the real estate that you have available to you yeah he's got visual right. aids going on <laughs> yeah. we consider not obviously with the 4k screen you've got hey. so much more available to you it's kind of nuts isn't it yeah and, and the fact Boop. that some of them pop ether out transfer out what the, the fuck screen. Go on, oh shit! I take it I have to take down these swords before they before he's fully charged, right? Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah. Ow, that's gonna hurt. Each, uh, remember, in, remember the dungeon. Um, you had a sword that did different things. Yep. If you take out certain swords, you don't have to deal with certain, uh, mechanics. From the, oh, I remember the last battle. <laughs> Where I had to deal with that shit. <laughs> With the spears and all that stuff. Oh no. It's gonna go horrible. Oh, 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 oh. Okay. No, What's he gonna do now? What's he gonna. Anymore. Fuck! I'm dead. Fuck. Alright, so where's it gonna put me? Hopefully, I don't have to do the Hien fight again. But knowing my fucking luck, probably. In 2020, Reynolds sold his aviation American gin to European beverage company Diageo as a part of a deal with an estimated $610 million. Holy shit. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, that guy technically doesn't have to work ever again. <laughs> I mean, I mean he's, yeah. He's way, way into being a billionaire. Yeah. He's, he's way past... He's, he's got... Wrexham Football Club as well. Yep. And the guy's made some fucking clever choices. And let's face it, he's also married to Blake Blythe. Yep. And they've got a good relationship. Th th this stuff is wholesome. <laughs> Their relationship is very wholesome. Yeah. I mean, Blake Lively is, not, is a pretty woman as well. Yeah. I mean... Obviously, we all had to suffer with Green Lantern. <laughs> He's still atoning for his sins uh, to this day. <laughs> Let's just put it that way, Tommy. The problem is, is the, the person who wrote the story and also who yeah. the people who picked the storyline. Yup. Fuck your face. Let's go. Semi Hager was the um, Van Halen guy, wasn't he? Sammy Hager, Sammy Hager, he's the Van Halen guy, right? Or oh, one of the Van Halen guys, because uh, David Lee Roth uh, uh, left the group for a while, didn't he? Jobs. Yeah. Oh my. Oh my. Oh my. You know, it's kind of pathetic that George Takei is only known for that that, that phrase nowadays. <laughs> he's not even really known for his acting anymore, is he? No, I mean, he's a fucking dickhead anyway. I mean, gran granted, he's doing voice acting now, so... Still got work. Yeah, I mean, you can't argue the fact that he's still earning, he's still working. Yep. But I can't take anything against anybody who's working. Yep. Anyone who, anyone's getting off their ass and fucking doing something, you can't... Fucking not that. Yep. Drink. What was always funny was uh, Bill Shatner saying, "Yeah, George Takei was a, a day worker." <laughs> yep. He was though. Very he was though. And he never he never took the deal to become a full time cast member, which is dumb, <laughs> considering how popular Star Trek was. Well, and all the uh, royalties that he could have been making, he could be still making, he could be making. Yeah, but yep. that's, that's where the pure genius of Alex Guinness came about, wasn't it? 
because mm -hmm. he didn't take a wage from Starbucks to put the uh, royalties. Was it two percent is on the royalties, yeah. I think it was like two or three percent or something like that. Yeah. Mm, something like that, yeah. Everyone thought, what the fuck are you doing? Tiny percentage, and yet, um, I mean, considering his contributions to number five, number six, um, it was a genius move. Absolutely yeah. fucking genius move. He made enough money that not even his great grandchildren need to work for him. <laughs> yeah. And he's got, he's got fuck you money beyond the grave. That's the, f that's the thing. Um, but shall I tell you what? I, I'd love, well, I'm gonna have to remortgage my house. And that's the problem. With me. It's fucking shit. Um, but at least for the last six years, I've been able to say I own my house outright without any mortgage. Um, and yeah, I'll, I'll do it again. Um, but it's, it's mainly because of the car and stuff that I'm having to remortgage the house. So I need to get a vehicle that's uh, suitable for me, Tam, and Coffee to get rid of. Mm. And the insurance are fucking around. So I'm going to have to remortgage the house. Uh, I'm going to do a couple of other things as well at the same time, just clear a few of the kind of like the sofa loan that you've, you've had for like a year and stuff. Paying it off, but just get rid of it kind of thing. Just taking the opportunity. Um, but yeah, having to fucking remortgage the house simply because the insurance company fucked it over. Ah, Sammy Hager was in Montrose with Ronnie Montrose and then as a solo. The Red ro Rocker and then Van Halen after David Lee Roth left. Not doing the Van Halen reunion tour with Michael Anthony and Joe Satriani. Hmm. Okay. Joe Satriani. Um, do you know the, the one thing I'll say about mortgages? Um, mm -hmm. From my perspective, from a financial perspective. Right. Um, I think that when you've achieved the position, and don't, don't get me wrong, I understand it's not going to be, everyone's going to be able to probably achieve it. Um, but it's kind of like one of those tick boxes in life kind of thing, where he's like, yeah, do you know what? I've done enough that I own my own house. I don't have to worry right. about it. It's my own house. No one can ever take it away from me. I just find that as a little tick box in mine, and it just pisses me off that the insurance company is just fucking with that kind of like that security I've had for the last six years because for me my my earnings and things like that I worry about the kids worry about Tam worry about the dog everything in between I don't really care about myself in the long run it's more their longevity because the wife doesn't work she's been retired for um, how long she's been retired now since 2007 I've never turned around to her and said you've got to work so she's just chilled out. I give her my pension money and she just does whatever she needs to do. Um, now, mm -hmm. I'm to be nervous. That's fucked with Tamsin's security. If I, if I ever kick the bucket, because it's less crazy. If I kick the bucket, she's got to sell the house. But she doesn't earn. She, she's got no uh, income to pay off him. Yep. Uh, it sucks. It's a massive fucking bitch. Apparently, you never heard what the tax man can do, Tombi. Yes. Mm. I mean, certainly, I know exactly what Mr. Taxman can do in many um, situations. There's ways around it, basically. There's ways around some of these things. Um, mm. Putting your house in a trust rather than it being given over to the kids. Um, if it goes into a trust, um, Mr. Taxman can't touch it in the UK. So it's like completely protected. Anonymous, hello everybody. I am playing on PS, won't, so won't reply, but cheers and thanks for all the fish. Anonymous, you enjoy yourself, my dude. Mm, you enjoy yourself, mate. Yeah, much love, bro. Much love, brother. Thanks for your stop and die. Uh, don't know how, uh, so comment by, I'm just catching up on some of the uh, chat. Don't know how many of your WoW or Final Fantasy 14 streams I've seen still have no idea what you're doing. Um, essentially, <laughs> What we're doing is this <laughs> this number that's this is this is the quickest way of explaining it. This number seventy-five needs to be ninety. That's it, done. And obviously this main scenario quest needs to be completed and there not be one. Hey Raxus. Um and then that's it. Fuck. Uh yes, I'm probably gonna say yes, fucking in the game would be good too. No, I've um, failed again, so I have to do it all over fucking again. I'm getting, really? I'm getting fucking flashbacks, yeah. 
Is that the swords you have an issue with? Mm, I had them down, but by f two were down. The third one was yeah. about to fall, and then, then boom! You just did the the, the bar was full already. Yeah. I don't have even enough time to actually kill all the swords in that short period of time. Yeah, it's fine I'm, though. I mean, I'm quite, quite fortunate that obviously from a range position, I'm, I'm able to stick dots onto the swords to get them yeah. started. Um, but I then suffer from the fact that I've got to move out of all of the damage that's going on the floor, all the AOE. Um, but it is, t it was tight. I mean, I was down to probably the last five percent and only just doing it because of the movement. Mm -hmm. So I would expect that they would um, at least make it. Do you have a dot as a tank? As a no. 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 Oh, that sucks. Because uh, in World of Warcraft, as a warrior, I'd have rend, so I'd rend the boss and it would slowly bleed, and I would get some kind of like um, damage going from there. Because obviously, when the AOE comes and you've got to move away from the um, swords, you can obviously apply your rends, move away, and it's slowly ticking off. Move to the next one. Go on to that one, rend it, go on to the next one, and just give it more so, Oh, I've completely stormed that. Thanks. I hope this doesn't turn into another two hour affair because if that that's the case, I'm gonna have, gonna be a bit less tolerant towards the difficulty and bump it down even quicker. I'm not going to deal with yeah, that shit for two hours. Yeah. Yeah, I don't want to make another five and a half hour stream. Yeah. I do have a gift for you after, Mr. Schmidt. Oh, do you? I do, I do. Mm. I do. I do. And I'm looking, I'm Some looking for one side. for also. Tandy. What does like? Um, I like... Chocolate? I say that, because just in case the wife is watching that sort of I'm not going to finish that sentence. That was a <laughs> crap. <laughs> that was a uh -oh. crap. Especially at 1 hour and 48 minutes, I'm going to make sure that is blurred blur deep out of existence. No, the I'm just... Is, the XP is increased. Here, I'll just, I'll just build, I'll just craft two real weapons that you guys can use, and oh, you both can look like twins. Oh! You can glamour, you can glamour them to yourselves. So lock it in, yay! Uh, I need to, I need to change my appearance so I look like Arnie and twins, and he can be Danny DeVito. <laughs> <coughs> Whatever you say. That would work. Honestly, it would work. Twinage. Twin, twins do it better, apparently. Soska's just as good as I'm Where are you right now, Mr. Tondo? Uh, I'm just going to more donuts. I'm in Revenant's toll at the I just realized that I misspelled Final Fantasy in the title. It, it says Final Fantasy 14. <laughs> I'm a retard. I'm a retard. Oh, Welcome to the group. Mate. Do you know? Do you reckon one day I'll be able to get away with Final Fat Ass 14? Yes. Probably. Just, well, you could. Just change it to that and see if see if anyone turns up. It's what the fuck? How did that fail? Um, uh, fuck off, game. Oh, um, you didn't stack on Lisa in the center. She had the wasn't a problem. Wasn't a problem arrows. last time. Wasn't yeah, a problem last time. Arrows, um, on her. Like I said, it wasn't a problem last time because last time I did that too, and she didn't die. No, I'm just saying, just saying. Come, come, come down, come down. Go easy, go very easy. Just get yeah, it done, mate. Fuck this game. Get it done. Fuck this. Yeah. Fuck, fuck this film. Fuck off, film. All right, so I need to switch to Alchemist. Yeah, I'll, be with, I'll be with you, gents, as soon as I can. No, Apologies I'm, for that. I'm in no rush because this gives me opportunities to run downstairs and grab a cup of tea, buddy. So don't, don't even stress about it. No one in chat stressing about it. So, uh, Rick, can I make two sixes look like the Olsen twins? Ah, right. Probably. Okay. I'm going to do a challenge you there, and I would say I would not touch the Olsen twins with a fucking barge pole. Give me Elizabeth Olsen, and then you can have as I would throw as much money as I can do. It. She is she is the better Olsen by far. Much better Olsen. Well, that goes without saying, I think. 
much better Olsen, especially considering that the Olsen twins look like sunk out of the dark. <laughs> That is also true. Fucking Jesus, this tweet is now here at 21,500 views. Oh, it's, it's almost 300 likes, this is big. I'm fucking sad that he's gone. Do you have glamour crystals on here? Uh, do I have glamour crystals on my friend? Yes, uh, probably. Let's have a look. Uh, yes, I've got, I've got glamour, I've got clear prisms, I've got glamour prisms, glamour dispellers. Um, then I would like to, oh, there's a scholar, never mind, I did the wrong, I did the wrong weapon. That's that's Oh, baby man, this summer, it's that time again, Kenny's, uh, Kenny's cooler is steak on the way, nice. Oh, nice. Nice. Uh, yes. Uh, I'm gonna go to Kagane. Yeah. So, if you wanna catch a ride, catch a ride. Kagane. Yeah. Yeah, I can sell that first one. Let's go. Okay. Oh right, he's got me trapped so, now. So. Uh, it's still like it, it's, it's really good in that video that you posted when he turns around <laughs> when he's facing backwards. It's like what the fuck. Oh, mm. yeah. Here it comes. The weave of a shinobi's power. Go, 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 go. Move, 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 move. At least there was people selling some of the gear here. Okay. Shit. Fuck your face. I'll tell you the other thing as well. Obviously, Sassy Sasquatch is also getting her monetization done as well. Mm hmm. I stuck, yep. so she, she was after that like 90 hours watch time, so I went onto my four accounts, bounced onto four different PCs, and queued up her longest place, uh, playlists, mm. and they were still, <laughs> still going. Oh dear. Really? That's what I did, <laughs> with, steel. What I did with steel leg as well, uh, but I just boost hours. Just massive amount of hours. Because the virtual machines just sit there, just Chundering along and just play it. It doesn't interfere, interfere with anything else I'm doing. Mm -hmm. Which, uh, which obviously. Um, Alright, that works. Really Follow. Let's go. I almost done with phase one. Yep, there you go. Phase one is done. Good job. Where phase is one is done. Party? Right next to the ether, right? Now I can. They're just. You. I fixed the title, by the way. The spelling fi mistake is fixed. <laughs> <laughs> Why is Mirden got uh, like no help? Uh, let's, uh, let's do this. Oh. 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 Is that now glam that to your weapon? Oh, right. Okay. I'm like, isn't that a lower um, item level? But glam it to your weapon and then open your weapon. Mm, right, okay. Uh, how do I glam? Uh, right click on the on your weapon in your in uh, on your weapon that you're holding. Yeah. And it should say glamour or cast glamour. Thank you, Varsity. Sir. Cast glamour. And I want to choose that one that you've just given me, which is Boop. that one. Cast. There you go. Now, Let's go. Now, oh, now take out the weapon. Zen. Oh. <laughs> That's fucking sexy, isn't it? At one angle, it looked like I was holding a pizza plate, but I'm glad I zoomed in. 
pizza cutter. Thank you very much indeed, sir. That's amazing. It's the fact that there's ink explosions just fucking going around the page. My I'm the darkest summoner ever. The darkness. Darkness summoner ever. And I have one. And I have one for the the smoo as well. So go get mm -hmm. the the captain plot out. Once I'm out of here, I will get it. <laughs> oh, the fucker is down to eight, eight, no, almost eighty percent now. So. Um. Look at what? What the fuck? The sweet fucking jiggly Jesus. It's amazing. Is that still a gun? Or is it just uh, a sword? This is a sword. This is the red mage. Mate, hey, that's sexy as fuck. Hold on. Two seconds. Stay in that position. Stay in that position. Right, get, it, it get, get, your mag get your magical chopper out again. <laughs> Here. There we go. There we go. <laughs> Stay very still. No. Oh, <laughs> he's, he's, he's Kylo Ren's me. Oh. <laughs> How do I just get rid of the UI again? F12. Um, print screen, wasn't it? No, that's screenshot. Uh, screen lock. Could he scroll on? Stab me in the testicle again. Kylo Ren, oh no, don't kill me! Uh, uh, oh shit, fuck. Oh, he's tickling me bump. Fuck. Right, fuck yeah. this, I'm gonna bump the difficulty down now. Fuck it. I've tried yeah. it enough times now, fuck this. Yeah, game. Fuck your face. What do you think of that, Tommy? Fucking show off. <laughs> fucking look at this dickhead. Fucking twirling with his fucking chopper. <laughs> you, you can do that you, too. Do slash v pose. Slash v pose. Oh yeah, it would help if I get rid of my victory, victory pose. I got chat in there, guy. Fuck, lost it. Oops. Oh, I'm taking someone's fucking order. What? <laughs> you dickhead. You get to twirl a fucking baton of death, and I get to take someone's fucking order like I'm in a bloody McDonald's. Watch this shit. I mean, it's like, hmm, 15 dollars, you wanna cope with that? Yes. I know, I don't deserve it. And here he goes. Fucking just chop me head off, you dickhead. Do battle stance. <laughs> oh, I ain't fucking doing nothing, you're telling me now. <laughs> fucking steel leg of history. I clipped it to that. Yeah, well, I'm gonna fucking. I'm gonna do exactly the same. This is now the fucking short. Short of elder abuse by Nirvi. Wow, one man Brian on your end donates oh, to 20 pounds yeah. for Poppy. Oh, nice. I'll tell you what, you guys have looked after no word of a lie from the financial position. Um, the physiotherapy is going to fuck it big time, which is another reason we're going down the lines of uh, remortgaging, just so that we don't have to worry about it. But Omid Brian, your generosity is unfathomed, my friend. Thank you very much indeed. It's fucking incredibly kind of you. It's incredibly kind. It's very kind of Brian, but I'm just yeah. laughing at what I'm doing behind Tommy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm not fucking paying attention I, I see, I, I, I can see it a little bit, Mirrodin. What are you doing there? <laughs> what are you doing? I'm, ta I'm taunting Tom <laughs> <laughs> it's, not, it's, it's not fucking working, dickhead. Working. <laughs> I just dropped you now. <laughs> do, you know, uh, um, do you know that the Tombi Poppy gives and go is one pound short of? 400 UK what? That's obscene. That's obscene. Yeah, 400, 400 quid. What? Um, Nina also posted 50 UK pounds into my PayPal for copy as well. So the way I figure it, with Ian Sofors 50 dropped the other day, mm -hmm. um, the 400 that's in Give Send Go, mm -hmm. the Tomhead Bryans, and. <clears throat> And a few of the um, other donations that have been made 
I think our uh, physiotherapy for the first three months is completely covered. All through the generosity of the chat, the generosity of our friends. The uh, I'm just gobsmacked. I actually fucking gobsmacked. Nothing really, nothing, nothing gets me emotional. Um, without, without too much of, uh, without any word of a lie. Nothing really gets me emotional. But the, the thing is, is when it comes to animals, that's the one real time where I find I have some form of emotion. And the fact that obviously helping Poppy out, that's why I really struggle with games where dogs get hurt. Give us a cat. Fuck cats. Fucking cat. I ain't a fucking cat person. Get fucked. Little bastards. They can look after themselves. But when it comes to dogs, because dogs just look at you innocently all the time. And it's like, if they do something, if, what, what was it? Fucking, you stand on a dog's paw accidentally, and they look to you as if they've done something wrong. Oh, steel leg of history. You didn't know you need to do that. Rick says, please keep the fund open until Wednesday. So what I said, um, so what I'm going to do in the community chat, so every, at the end of every week, so every Sunday, for the next four weeks, I'm going to put it in, and I said online that when Poppy's first physio is booked, that's when we'll um, just close it down at that point. And then right. all of the funds that are there will then go into booking the uh, weekly <coughs> physiotherapy, because she's going to need... She's going to need one, the physio checkup, but she's also right. going to use the um, aqua therapy where they they walk in and they it's kind of like a treadmill, it's a uh, swimming pool kind of thing. Um, yeah, and she gets the exercise that way. She's getting a little bit pissy at the minute as well because, um, um, because she's really confined to essentially a, nothing more than a, a six foot square um, in fact it's probably not even, yeah it's got to be a six foot square area um sounds about right and her, yeah and her bed is in that six foot square area um she's really getting pissy now now she, considering that she's quite an intelligent dog as well i would be going stir crazy and you can see it you can see it she's um, Tam's also going to be going away for a few days, um, so I'm going to be working downstairs, I think not this week, next week when the daughter comes. Mm -hmm. Tam, needs, Tam needs a break, so she's going to go back to the daughter to uh, strap it up on Abel where the kids are, uh, just, mm. just to get that uh, bit, of, bit of fresh air in a way. She's stuck in that room, same with Poppy. Um, because and she needs a break too every once in a while. Yeah, exactly. Me, I, he doesn't face me. My brain doesn't work that way. So I don't get frustrated by being in the same room constantly. But, I mean, I'm in this room fucking pretty much every day, 18 hours a day. I'm not just not monster. Me, Man, not fuck your way. face, Zenos. Fuck your face, Zenos. But yeah, thank Are you very much indeed for your generosity, guys. And that's generosity to me, generosity to Smoo as well. Um, yeah. Just make sure we pop into Gaming with Smoo channel. Drop, mm -hmm. drop, in, drop in a like. Yes, sir. Follow. Share, subscribe, and all that. I need to start dragging all of my. Uh, the rest of my Boulder's Gate to get them loaded. It just takes so long to render because it's all in 4K. 4K so takes forever to render lately. Hey, it's, it's obscene. Oh, that goes very quickly now. I've, uh, now. now I've bumped the difficulty down. I get those swords down within like three or four swipes. That's ridiculous. I was just about to mention that. <laughs> uh, that's, that's a ridiculous man, honestly. I'm pretty sure <laughs> the only fuck people you. commenting on this tweet are all bots. But looking at them... Yeah, I mean, some of these have got to be bots. I am on yours. I see you. 
Um, Anani moves. It's all smoke and mirrors. I don't know who who said that. Where were? Where did that come from? No idea. Where did you come from? Where did you go? Where did you come from? Cut an eye. Anonymous. Smash that like, by the way, guys. I'm at 12 likes. Let's just make make it 20, folks. Let's make it 20. Let's make it 20. Keep unliking and liking it, then. How's that? <laughs> Are you just pointing two thumbs towards your screen? Because they count as well. <laughs> See you didn't lose them. I have, I've liked yours. I think I was the 10th like on your stream. <laughs> yeah, I've liked Something it. like... I'll tell you what I'm also going to do is while, while you're sitting that far. I'm going to uh, on... A bouncy castle? You're buying a bouncy yeah, castle for me? That's too kind. I'm going to switch on to the combi with gaming account and drop a like. Wee! Mr. Horny! Mr. Horny! Combi does the gaming Oh, it does a game. Video, video games. Video games. Uh, video games. Boom, boom. I like the way that my fourth account is just called Tombi's fourth account. <laughs> that sounds like you. Yeah. There we go. Well, fuck, fuck your face, Enos. Look, look at all those, those vulnerability stacks you got on. <laughs> what do you mean? The number eight that's above Xenos' name, that means you take yeah. damage harder. You yeah, eight, damage. eight times. Yeah, I know. I like to put my, set myself a challenge, mate. You know that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm tanking way too hard. I'm taking my job very damn seriously. That's the problem. <laughs> um, Let's go, Webby. Woo! Fuck so yeah. Brian, um, let me just put this HTTPS. <laughs> Your hush money's on the way. YouTube.com. Forward slash at Fuck your face. the DJ, and if you add a tag on live to the end of it, that'll always take you to someone's live channel. So e. up to the so uh, Bombed Brian, just in chat for you there, mate. If you That's click the main that channel. The link, that'll take you to the basically the live stream or the next live stream booked. If there isn't a live stream, it'll take you to the channel instead. So oh, always go, it. always go for those. I'm so that's glad why, this is over now. That's why with all of my uh, links that I'm doing, it's all the Inside All Day podcast with the live, the Outcast mm -hmm. creators with the live. Wait. Something to go on Ace. No, please. Um, yeah, just let me end the quest real quick. <laughs> I'll, I'll, I'll be right back here. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm gobsmacked over that, uh, Bombed Brian. Thank you very much indeed. And steal you, you, your generosity has been crazy, guys. Crazy. Seriously. I mean, I get the emails. Full disclosure, I get the emails whenever somebody donates to the gift send go. So I do see what money comes in. But but sometimes I just look, check my emails and I'm just shaking my head like how crazy generous you guys are. It's, it's amazing. And yeah. uh, this I, this goes without saying. This is my third gift send go that I set up. And this is the second most successful one. The first one I did raised about one thousand five hundred dollars for a legal f legal f uh, fund for one of the Discord modrotics because he was in an Amazon warehouse and he got injured and he wanted to sue them because he got uh, partial disability because of it. That's all I'm going to say about that. Hey, and we're done with Stormblood. Fuck yeah! Congratulations. Yeah, baby. We're done. And uh, yeah, that's all I'm gonna say because that's the most been the most successful gift send go I've ever set up, thousand five hundred dollars. And, and uh, you know what? I love giving back to people. And that's why I love do doing these fundraisers for. Now, granted, I don't see a fucking I don't see a fucking penny of this. But this all goes to Tomby. I'm just, I'm just saying, you know. I mean, technically, yes, it does come to me, but um, it goes to Poppy, and that's the most well, important thing. Well, that's that's the most important thing. That's Absolutely. Going straight onto Poppy. And oh, the thing is, is absolutely. That as long as we are updating, I'm just going to log in to give some go and see if I can put a post an update in there. Yeah, you, yeah, you should actually post an update there. <laughs> I mean, you've got the details, so might as well. Yeah, yeah, I'm just, I'm just doing them now. Oh, ooh, that cyan gear looks. Incorrect, ooh, incorrect username or password. Really? Yeah. Huh. Um, to Kogane, please. Yes, sir. That is Scion gear looks pretty fucking sick. 
Is um just just to confirm. Go into your armoire. Your, um, yeah. Is uh, smooth. Is your email got a number in it? Just in case that number's wrong. In. Um. In, let me just check the details. What I sent you. Hang on. What we'll do it? I probably forgot to put the number in it in the email address. No, there there is a number there. I just wanted to make sure it's um. It was there was definitely supposed to be one there. Uh, was it the number three? Was it? I don't fucking tell everybody what it is, but yes, that was it. Yeah, yeah. Uh, that was, yes, don't yeah. Worry. Well, oh. deal. We'll deal with it. We'll deal with it off stream. It's fine. It's fine. Okay. Right. Use it, to, uh, smoo, and then glam it to your weapon and shield. Okay. I want to break free. You're the placing it in armory I chest, right? Or was it just? You don't okay. need to. Okay. You don't need to. Just, okay. Okay, cast glamour. Biako is in the spirited stone sword. Okay, All right, got that and through the shield. Yeah, that looks ridiculous already. Uh, okay, let's see. All right, now pull your weapon out. Excuse me while I whip this out. Ooh. <laughs> Cheers, steel leg for the blurp. Hang on. Let me and see so what, what you is. guys can do now is let's go to the inn real quick, and you can put those items in your inn armor Ooh. and store them so you don't have to keep them in your inventory. That's a good idea. Yep. Good shout. That's a good idea. Bokaru. Bokaru. So those were expensive <laughs> items, and I want you to keep them. <laughs> um, fully, fully agreed, and um, exactly the same, Brick. When when family needs the help, we're all there. And it, do yep. it doesn't matter whether it's financial or just prayers and thoughts. Yep. It's the fact that you're there. It goes without saying, though. <laughs> yeah, crazy. You, mm, thanks, guys. So just go to the armoire and put what you want to store in the armoire, and you're good to go. You got like 800 storage items in there, too. Not oh, the armoire, the glamour dresser. Uh, gl glamour dresser, sorry. But you can also do those, too. Can I put the glam stuff into the uh, dresser now, or is it, uh, or do I need to keep it in? No, you can put it in the. You can put it in there. You don't need Stores to glamour, there. right? Okay. Yeah. Stores glamour. Uh, yes. As long as you have glamour crystals, you can store things. Yeah, I think I still I still have some. Oh, uh, it's so actually I... quite good because I still have something. Hang on. Uh, huh? All we need okay. is some kind of buckaroo. And you can store all the um, uh, Scion gear in there, too. Mm-hmm. Well, the Scion gear actually, actually looks pretty cool. <laughs> Not gonna lie. I have no uh, idea. Uh, Midden, teach mm -hmm. me like I'm stupid. Um, how does this... Ah, right, yeah, I'll get you, get you, get you, get you. Um, army, oh. chest, main hand, weapons, and all this shit. So, ju yeah, just do main, uh, main hand, weapon... Body, hands, legs. head, and feet and legs. Don't do accessories. Yeah. There's no reason and, to put accessory items there. And you just double click it? Mm hmm. Okay. How do I. Or you could right click it, I think might be able to. That's probably easier, yeah. Right, right on. Right, okay, there we go. That's what I'm after. So in World of Warcraft, I can obviously shift click any item uh, to see what it looks like, to see whether I actually want to put it. In the thingy me jigger. Mm -hmm. oh, I don't want to fucking compare it, you fucking dickhead. So about that FNT episode uh, the other day, <laughs> that was uh, pretty nuts, <laughs> wasn't it? That was crazy having uh, Vivek on. There. Vivek on that was that was like holy shit. I, we didn't know that would would happen, and even the mods were like, holy crap. That was all Benny. Yep, that was Benny. Shout out to Benny, Benny. Johnson, by the way. Shout out to Benny Johnson. What a good sport that man is. Mate, can you imagine if suddenly randomly Benny joined joined in the chat? He said, yeah, no worries. I would probably have to yeah. double check the chat if that would happen. Yeah, a buckaroo me tie. Yeah, but it's, um. it's like um, Mirren. You know John Cena. Hang on, I've got the perfect sound for that one. This is, is true. It? Yeah. I'm waiting for the sound. Yeah, I'm just looking for it. Where, where the fuck okay, did it go? Okay, why are you looking for that? Do you know that John Cena is now following Steel Legger History on yep. YouTube? Oh, wow. 
Yeah. And <laughs> wait for it. Wait for it. Are you sure about that? <laughs> John Cena. Bum, 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 bum. <laughs> Bow, 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 bow. Yeah, John Cena following our boy Steel Legger history. Fucking amazing. Well done, mate. Crazy that one. Going. The now, Vivek. Ro to... ro no. Yeah, go ahead. What you want to do, Steel Leg, what you want to do is just send him a message and say, um, Do you ever play any games and stuff? Like PC <laughs> or Xbox games? And just say, If he says wrestling, say that's fucking gay. Um. <laughs> But if he plays yeah. anything else, say, do you want to play together? Or I just want to give you a kick in. Want to play a zombie game? <laughs> one leg, but... <laughs> I want to ask him if he plays zombie games. Yeah. I want to fuck your face. Da -da. Okay. Uh, uh, you guys are ready? I'm, out, I'm outside. Yeah. Uh, I'm coming out. Yeah. Here's the explosion. Yep. Mm, wait, no. Nope. There it is. Sliding door. The sliding door. Oh, I tell you what, the loading screens are amazing. Oh, you like the? Uh, it's the faster new loading? as well. It is faster. Mm -hmm. it, it does teleport you a lot faster all of a sudden. Hmm. And it's nice too. It gives you a little thing to look at. Mate, it's yeah, beautiful. it's a ni nice visual that you get from that. Fantastic visual. All right, so where to next, gents? Uh, um, more donuts. Six, eight, more. Oh yeah, you didn't hand in the quest, did you? No, because uh, I was waiting for everyone to do. All right. Well, I, I actually ended it in already, but I'll wait for you. That cyan gear looks pretty cool, though. It looks Aww. looks a bit like uh, that one Flash villain, Al Alchemy, or whatever the fuck his name is. Where are you going? Tracy. Oh, yeah, okay. Oh, yeah. There we go. That one. Tracy! Yeah, because we've we've got a dungeon. Um, yes, sir. At least I thought he was. Uh, Who? Yeah. Tombi, you're welcome. Steel Leg says Vivek won the nerd vote of in mm -hmm. 2008. Yep. Oh, shit, fuck. He oh, doesn't fuck. like the MCU either, <laughs> even though he's got kids. So. Yeah, but the thing is, is that yeah, that and that's a protection of uh, a decent father usually. Take the boat to the, the survey side. I won't recommend MCU to any of the kids anymore. Nope. You get fucked. Yep. Hashtag fuck your face. Block kick that tataru. Hey. Careful, careful with my fellow potato there. Be, uh, oh, drop kicker? I want to kick a potato. I'm going to uh, German suplexer. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> It's the fact that you start fucking bashing her in the fucking back and it's like smash the granny out of her. I've got a game where you can German suplex enemies and it looks fucking amazing. So welcome to Stormblood or uh, uh, Shadowbringers, guys. Holy Thank shit, we did it. Um, the XP is... What the fuck, man? <laughs> Let's see, where did they send you? Oh, the music. Right. So we're in... You guys should, we're in you the... guys should watch some of the... Uh, you should watch some of these cutscenes. I'm watching the current one. Why can't I mount? You don't uh, have a mount here, buddy. What do you mean? I can't use the old mounts. Are they expansion specific? You have gone to a place that you should have been watching the cutscene for, but I can explain well, it to I, you. You've I been kind shifted. Of like... You've been shifted from one star to the nether, another. You've been shifted from our star to oh. the first. So you're in a place where there are no, you're, ma you're not connected. You're disconnected from our world. Yeah, I'm mean, seeing the ether world currently, where everybody's like, "What? We're in the shadow realm." Look at that fucking Jesus! Big fucking crystal. Honestly, the 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 144 hertz setting with the monitor right now looks fucking amazing. How smooth that yeah. is, all right. And I've got a curved monitor as well. And people told me, don't play a fucking curved monitor. Honestly, I that's have, one of... I have, two cur I have two curved monitors. People curved told me curved they're shit. The people, some people told me they're I, shit. <laughs> I love them. Curved monitors are the way ahead. Yep, they're better for your eyes as well. Oh. It's a new... Um, Whoa, new what the... F that's curved. an interesting change of pace. Or oh, is this the Escape or whatever it's called? 
It's definitely some Shadow Realm thingy. There's definitely something shadowy going on. The scary this door. World, this world is called the First World. The first it's world. The world of, it's the world of light. <gasps> mm. Yeah, pretty fitting because we are the warriors of light after all. Not but with Tessa Thompson. Wow. <laughs> but guess what we're going to be? What, guess what you're going to become in this world? The warrior of darkness. Yes. Mm -hmm. and because of Shadowbringers, that makes sense. <laughs> <laughs> Where there's light, there's darkness, after all. <laughs> Rick saying, not with Tessa Thompson making strap-on jokes to, to a supposed 16-year-old girl and assuming that she's married to Captain Marvel as well, don't forget. Mm. Gujira minus one. Oh, I want to I wanna like watch Gujira minus one without color. That looks fucking amazing, by the way. So, Tommy, by run the way, around, grab all the crystals. Yeah, I'm fucking, I'm on it, carbonic, coming tits. I can't believe we're in the third expansion already. That's kind of nuts. <laughs> and Alden looks very confused right now. From endless dreams, I awake. We. Uh, Alden looked like he had too much to drink. <laughs> <laughs> looks like my like my home world. <laughs> yeah. Back, Something Pete. vague Welcome yet back. urgent calls me to action once more. Okay. Um, Pete. Did you want to play Left 4 Dead for uh, Left 4 Dead tomorrow? Do let us uh, know. Myself, myself and Smoo were wondering whether you wanted to uh, do a uh, partake in a freeway. <laughs> hey oh! <laughs> <laughs> and of course, if anyone else is, we can do uh, uh, do four. We can yeah, four four humans is better than having one AI companion. I'll, I'll tell you that can, much. We can tag team each other like fucking centipedes. No, no. The darkness doesn't allow that, Tommy. You know you want my hand in your buttocks. Oh no, I'm going to go the other way and run away. <laughs> <laughs> you, 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 know, you know you the you need Hola. my hand Bonjourno. in... I do not in, need uh, to be a puppet like Tommy. <laughs> 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 no, oh good. man, you the music. Oh, the music. Yeah, music's good, isn't it? Damn. Is it okay if I pop in here? Yeah, of course it is. No, sure. Okay, sure, good. man. No echo, right? Nope. No echo at all. No echo. Good, 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 good. We don't, uh, we don't yeah, I'd love to. Just tell, me a, just tell me a time. Cool. Happy days. Uh, well. What, what, what time zone are you on? That's I am on Central. Central. Okay, that makes it a lot easier for us then. Um, we'll we'll we'll, we'll figure. I feel something. like that's a dig at me. Just. <laughs> what do you mean? Just DM. Just DM me, and I should be able to pop on. Okay. Happy days. Cool. Uh, How's the snow, by the way? It's friggin' freezing, Mister Bigglesworth. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck's sake! I just want snow here because I, I fucking love the snow. I just, do you know what I love the most about the snow? Is how What's quiet up? everything becomes. I have mm -hmm. 120 oh. pounds on a good day. I'm not built for the cold. Oh, bless you. So, you, so you're not like me and fucking 240 pounds of um, angry rugby player. <laughs> no, I love, I love the snow because it's the only, it's the only time I'm, I'm really. I don't know what it is about it. I fucking hate the sun. Deep I gold stuff. I hate the wow. sunlight. I'm I, the exact I may opposite. Well be a may as well be a vampire. A vampire. Oh, yeah, people are vampires. Yeah. I, I I probably shouldn't be, but I'm actually kind of excited for that Indiana Jones game. Oh yeah. <laughs> You're brave. You sure you want to be happy about that one? From, I am well, from a review perspective. I here's my thing. I. Toddy is a big fan of Indiana Jones games, and he's yeah. made several in the mm -hmm. past, and they were okay. Um, but the whole machine games thing doesn't fill me with uh, doesn't fill me with hope and optimism. Nope. Um, just and a quick question, Mirden. I don't have the glam on my weapon anymore. Is that oh, normal? You... Yeah. Well, you changed weapons. Well, not intentionally. 
He put the other weapon back on. The one that you glammed. Because you switched over to the... Um, Not intentionally, weapon. I swear. <laughs> no, it's alright. So you basically you have to... You can build yourself a glamour plate. In yeah, your, uh, probably in should. And that'll... You can just do the weapon and shield and just apply it. No, that never way. mind, I've got it back on. For some reason the game actually applied the best gear immediately, which was a bit weird. Even though the sort I have right now is much better than the other one. Do you have I a have a the... chopper? Hmm? Oh my! <laughs> Do you chopper. have a fantastical chopper? Yes. Oh my! All right, let's get that ether. Right. Oh wait, hang on. There's the the little ether stone over here. Let me forget. You, you were going to say, Pete? I think I interrupted you. Yeah. No, it's fine. All right, sir. Oh dear me! Time to crack me neck. Oh, do you have Do you have Halo by chance as well, Pete? Just stuff out of curiosity. No, but I need to get it again. I had it on my old account. Master Chief Collection is on Steam. I'm just saying because if you. If it you is. And, uh, yep. I, 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 I think need, I gifted I to that to you, Tommy. Didn't I? Didn't I gift it? Gift Master Chief Collection to you? Uh. Um. Or was it? Or was that Borderlands? I'm trying to trying to think right now. Borderlands. Yeah, Borderlands. Two. Borderlands. Two. Two. Right, yeah, the, Master, two. the Master Chief Collection is awesome. Oh yeah, you it is. Not, if you, it's great for co-op. I held off it back in the day with the brother. Strongly recommend it. Best best co-op experience I had in years. <laughs> I can't believe how many fucking games I've gone out. It's fucking stupid. It's obscene, isn't it? How Especially. It grows. It's yep. Like, and the fact that it's quite a few of these were all gifted, and that's what that's the other thing I can't like, fucking factor in. I'm like. Okay, I'll just pay for this game, pay for that game, and then I'll, I'll think, do you know what? I, um, this person's got this on their wish list. Fuck okay, it, why not? And people are doing the same to me, but I haven't got a wish list. I do, but I don't expect people to give shit, shit to me. <laughs> I am a vampire, and I'm still long for the. I still long for the sun. Well, that's that's a given, okay. right? Okay. Yeah, the score of the expansion is on point. The, honestly, I've listened to some of the songs of Shadowbringers already because it's on Spotify. And honestly, this is probably next to Heaven's War, probably one, my favorite OST currently for Final Fantasy XIV. I mean, Endwalker is allegedly even better, but I don't know about that because I haven't heard it yet. But the I'll. I'll oh, yeah. I'm just getting all the ether, ether thingies. Yeah, that's that's basically all all I've done as well. I'm just making sure that I've got them all. Are we going in here? Oh, that's 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 perfect. And I think you missed the one. Yeah, I think so. Where the pendants is. Ah, oh, that's easy. Um, it's actually downstairs. I can't. Uh, yeah, I really, downstairs though. Come back to the aetherite in the center. Yep. The plaza. Mm-hmm. What an absolute cluster. Yep. It's this way, Tommy. Yep. I'm just Wait for me, I'll come with you. Following the yep. Fish. yep. I wasn't uh, talking yeah, about yeah. you, I was talking about that uh, that avowed. I'm editing a video to do with that yep. and uh... Yeah, I've I've watched avowed and I'm like, eh, I'm not too sure about that one just yet. It's basic it, it remind it's basically playing a spell sword in Skyrim, but all the time. Oh. Uh, kick mm. lost its uh, stream, Tombi. It's okay, mate. Uh, your uh, kick yeah, is... Yeah, yeah. Start, start, start. Thank you very much indeed. I need to get some form of alert going. Ooh, Where's angry it? Canadian. Hmm. Angry Canadian. I know this is probably mean-spirited of me a little, but... I'm sorry, the one guy who was talking about the combat, he looks kind of like Neanderthal. <laughs> To be fair, uh, that's I, a lot of people. I'm not saying it to be cruel, it's just funny. <laughs> to be fair, you're not wrong. Uh, well, he well, looks more like more like a man than that thing that was talking about Indiana Jones and making it for modern audiences. Oh. Don't even get me started on that person. I have the dubious uh, problem of being a Bethesda fan in current year. Uh. I, I like. Okay, I, I like. like a lot of Bethesda titles. I like a lot of the games they've made. Elder Scrolls, I could probably jaw you off for hours about Elder Scrolls lore, but I'm not gonna. But modern Bethesda is just sad. Because they've lost most of the people who made it good. 
Like, Michael Kirkbride, the guy who wrote most of the, like, really crazy lore for, for Bethesda games, he's gone. Uh, yep. Ted Peterson and, you know, Julian Lefay, the guys who started the studio, are, you know, off doing their own thing. And Yep. I mean, I have hopes for that game, but... Uh... It's like Rockstar Games without the Hauser Brothers. It's, it's not the same. Really. And... I mean, I played Starfield. I also was stupid and pre-ordered it. Ooh. Oh no! Oh no! Yeah. And the Why? game Why? wasn't okay. I, I I have the okay. I I said at the time that Starfield wasn't that bad, um, because I played it and I know yep. a lot of people were having tons of bug problems, but the copy I had, okay, yeah, it's pretty darn stable. Like it works. You can be lucky I've, with that kind of stuff. <laughs> it, bar like, it barely has any. Yeah, and... that's a reasonable thing to expect. That's a re we And certainly my issues, I I'll let you carry on in a sec. My issues with that whole game was nothing to do with the... Um, well, no, I'm not even going to open a fucking can of worms. You carry on, Pete. Mine carry absolutely on. were to do with that whole thing. And it was also mm. to do with the gameplay. Because my problem with Bethesda games for the last... 15 years? Uh, well, basically since since Skyrim, okay, has been. Skyrim, oh. They okay. are not RPGs. Yes. Okay? Correct. They are not RPGs anymore. They are action-adventure titles. Yes. Okay? Yes. Now, Starfield did some good things in regards to that. Um, it added back in... You know, it added back in traits. Uh, it kind of sort of started you out with a class, which, hey, I'm all for. But there right. were other serious issues in regards to the exploration and that. Because there is some cool things in regard to that. Like, I gave the game a fairly high re review score because I enjoyed it. But mm -hmm. the problems with Starfield are the procedural generation was done poorly. Yes, okay, what we very. were... Um, mm -hmm. Procedural generation has come a long way since the days of Daggerfall. And that's Daggerfall's big claim to fame. It was really the one that... Because you can walk all the way across the game map in Daggerfall. Basically all across the Iliac Bay. Yes. Without fast traveling once. Yep. And now, it would take you your entire life because Daggerfall is basically as big as Great Britain. Yes, correct. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> It's the, it's, it is it is one of the biggest, biggest game, game worlds world. ever made. Yep. Which, considering for when it was made, the game is older than I am, that's awesome. Um, but it was procedurally generated so they could do that. But the problem was you had a lot of saminess. You go into one dungeon in Daggerfall, and eh, it's a lot like the other dungeons in Daggerfall. Now, the dungeon design in Daggerfall is better than pretty much every Bethesda game since. Mm -hmm. uh, there are multiple paths you can take in a lot of them. Um, different design features that are really cool in a lot, you know, in most of them. But it's still samey. Because yeah. they're, you know, go here, kill the thing, do this, you know, push a couple levers if you're lucky. And congratulations you're done with the dungeon but yep. and plus there was a ton of backtracking which was a pain in the butt if you didn't have the teleportation spell um but with modern bethesda games the it's point mm -hmm. a from point to point b basically uh you can see this in starfield you can see this in skyrim all the dungeons have a convenient uh locked door right next to the front of the dungeon, you know, that kind of thing. 161,000 kilometers. Wow. Yep. Oh, yeah. That's nuts. Okay. If you haven't, in... Daggerfall is free on Steam, by the way, Snoo. Uh, is it? I'd suggest playing it with Unity, with Daggerfall okay. Unity, the mod for it, because Unity makes it playable. Like, Daggerfall is playable on a modern game, console, or PC, which I use PC. In its current state, because it's got it's run on like DOSBox, and you know you can do that, but it's uh, 
you you should get unity because it adds a ton of quality of life improvements like allowing you to quick save and number yeah. your saves so you can have more saves than six because there are only six save slots in the original one right but See, this, yeah this, this, right okay so when it comes down to procedural generated maps the, a lot of the engines these days are getting it wrong uh, massively getting it wrong yep. and do you know which game implemented the best procedurally generated map system mm. by the way tommy tommy just a Mag quick heads up um sorry Mag sorry Pete. you just got five pounds on uh, gifts and go by the way Did I? yep oh shit i just realized i actually gave you the wrong email address for the gifts and go <laughs> that's right i'll i'll, I'll, I'll oh, give you the right one after even. the stream steve is um, so obviously Stephen, thank you very much indeed for the five pounds donated and I'm just wondering have we got a Steve in the chat just let me know if you're there I'm, I'm wondering thing. if that's uh, that's a, a d American dollars right yeah uh, okay. no five GBP pounds hmm yeah is that maybe Rich. Steve 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 well that's the other thing I'm just wondering whether it is Steve 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 six four four six four. Mm, I've been wondering about that one too. Sure. Probably is. Uh, but either way, right, okay, coming back to what I was saying. Minecraft yes. implemented the seed system, which technically is a procedurally generated map. Now, there's absolutely no reason why planets in Starfield or in any game couldn't have a seed applied to them that then yes. generated the um, environment as and when they were accessed. One of the big problems I found with Starfield is that you could land in one location, lift off, land in this, uh, land in a an adjacent location, or go back to the same one, and it'd be completely different. Yeah, that was one of my completely big problems different. with it too. How how can you fucking take off and land in the same spot, and it'd be different because the procedurally generated maps were fucking shit. And <laughs> yes, yep. I can understand that you can copy and paste. Um, the same element, so you can have a building that looks like the same as another building in some other location. But if you use the procedural generation cleverly enough, mm -hmm. and you're seeding the maps, and technically you can also um, adjust how the buildings look, with the position of things, how the tables look, so they're not all exactly the same every time. I mean, by rights, I could I could put two, maybe three procedurally generated algorithms together it would probably take me about a week but I would, I can guarantee that you would go to different places they would be completely different and if you return to the original places that along your journey they would look exactly the same I would also then implement over the top of that seasonal changes and seasonal changes will be based on if we're talking about a space simulator then obviously seasonal changes will be based on how many stars are in that system what the positions of the planets are in that system if the planet's too far out and there's only so much heat coming from the fucking star which can be calculated because we've got all of that in terms of physics then i know what the season's going to be and how cold it's going to be on the planet all of it can be fucking procedurally generated i should go into fucking game dev but the problem is with going into game devs i have all the common sense in the world well the you're thinking is they don't want you're thinking of this as you're, you're thinking of this problem from the uh, position of someone with talent. <clears throat> mm. And we're and talking about problem. current year Bethesda. Yeah, that's mm -hmm. the problem, isn't it? Current year Microsoft because, in general. Because what they're looking at is how quickly can we turn something around to make us money, minimal effort? What, can, what kind of checkbox can we apply? Oh, I know, every time they land, let's just procedurally generate a map Use the same, um, use the same uh, objects and things like that. Just stitch it all together. They'll be happy with that. It'll look well, different every time. Fuck it. I talked about this way back, but hmm. I don't know if anyone else caught this in the uh, interview that Todd Howard did with was it Game Informer or IGN? I can't remember. It was one of the big, you know, shill sites. And basically, what they said was that. Starfield, you know, Starfield that's been in development for eight years? Yeah. Uh-huh, yeah. 
it only gelled right around the time of the Microsoft acquisition. That is good to hear. <laughs> that doesn't surprise me. That so basically what happened, you know, no, I'm reading between the lines here, of yep. course. But basically what it sounds like to me is, you know, they're like, oh crap, Microsoft is buying us. Quick, turn this game out as quickly as possible. Yep. And that's what so I they don't sack us. Mind. Because they haven't been, they've allowed for uh, feature creep and everything. Yeah. And they haven't been coming at the game with a clear goal. Yep. They've been reckon... coming. Right. So I'll, I'll, I'll just interrupt you there for a second. Do you You're think right from a acquisition from Microsoft's perspective that they turned around and said, um, we're not going to acquire anyone unless that game is complete. Uh, and then they just rush and turn out a turd. I have no idea. The thing is, Microsoft seems to be trying to buy the planet at the moment. Yep. yep. And I'm unsure as to whether or not... I mean, on the one hand, I don't think that Microsoft is a whole lot worse than, say, Sony. And that might be a controversial statement for some people, because so Sony, let's just be honest, hasn't treated a lot of game devs, you know, devs very well either in the past. I mean, they're not as bad as, say, Square Enix with Eidos Montreal, but they're not, yeah. not great either. Yep. Yeah. And that is a bit of a problem. Sorry. Um with the whole people who are arguing against it, you know. Well, they shouldn't have bought Bethesda because, you know, they're treating Bethesda, you know, Bethesda's employees awfully. They're rushing them in... Well, the thing is, Bethesda has had, had at the time of acquisition, eight years to work on this, okay? They had eight years to get this game right, okay? Yep. And, yeah, Starfield is a big game, but you have eight years. Yeah. You had eight years to get this game functional, and basically, from what I heard, they bas they just twiddled their thumbs for most of that time, throwing around ideas, and were like, well, what about this? What about this? What if we add crafting? What if we add uh, spaceship modification? What if we add, you know, yep. all these extra features that no one really wanted? Uh, right. And we got Starfield because at the 11th hour, Microsoft comes in and is like, hey, we'd like to buy you. And Bethesda was like, we would like to be bought. Yep, 100%. And that's, this is the thing, they, they did want to be bought. And well, I, I'm just reading between the lines in terms of... This is something I pointed, I would, yeah. this is something I would like to point out here. Game devs don't make as much money as you think. Correct. Because while they do release games that make millions of dollars, they do not they get it. They get also, pennies. Well, mm -hmm. they also spend years in development, and game mm -hmm. development is expensive. Okay. Yeah, because because the thing is, is that there's no guarantee that the game is actually going to come to fruition or complete. So it's always a proof of concept, almost always. It's always a gamble whether a game is going to be um, actually functional, whether they're going to spend one year um, investigating um, and kind of like pitching some ideas, meetings. I mean, I can, I can just look at how much I cost the business in terms of my time, um, how many meetings I would have to have, get some uh, developers in just to throw a quick idea. Does this work? Does that work? It's that and the other and you can go to the 13th hour and then suddenly it's like this game is just not not delivering what we're expecting it to do it's it's not and it's not playable. then you throw in the major problem of feature creep yeah because starfield if it suffers from any major issue besides the world rending wokery it's the feature creep yeah starfield has it's why does a sea and deep as a puddle Yep. in a lot of ways and you know i like a lot of the things about starfield i like the 
you know, I don't hate the crafting of the weapons and stuff. I couldn't, I, I don't like what they did with the spacesuits because, you know, there's basically nothing there. Um, but the game has a lot of good ideas mm. as singular ideas for a different game. Yep. I but, a moment, Brian. You, but you've got a bunch of them thrown in together into this game where they don't really gel well together. Yeah. And the... the what are you teleporting to, Tommy? I went and I've come back. Um, so there's there's two quest lines going in conjunction at the minute. Yep. Um, Alizé so and uh, Alfie, right? Yeah, so the one that is currently on my map is the one that you're currently doing. So in search of Alice, um, speak to Cassard. And now Cassard is in a different location. That obviously you're going to come back here in a second. If not, yep. you're already here. I'm, I'm coming so, back. It's a case of going over to. What I think we need to the leave the city and then get there, right? Yeah. Tell us the yeah, I think it's the gatekeeper. Ouch. Yeah, carry on, Pete. Nuts. Nuts! It seems to, you know, a lot of these features seem to be something that they kind of, like, workshopped, and then half-implemented. Yes. You know, I like... I like the Bethesda style of game. I like the third person and you know but then you can have third person if you want to for you know s's and g's but the game engine they're running isn't they didn't you know a lot of people are like aren't they using like the same engine they used for like oblivion and that's not true they did rebuild the engine to modern spec and it's okay but it feels rough. Hmm. Yeah. You know, it feels like they didn't quite think everything through. So it's time to and come I think, back to the first. I think yeah, that a I'm lot of people's in this quest soon as I'm here. major problems with, say, the planets was you couldn't go everywhere on the planet. You got yeah. shoehorned and Now, the maps are big, I'll give them that, but they're big and empty. Most of the time. Now, I... I dropped into one a couple weeks back that was like packed to the gills with bases and stuff it was pretty cool but overall most planets you go to are going to be pretty empty empty and sparse yep and a lot of people I, I, what's the point do you know what? Well, you, you, know what you, go those world, you go to those worlds for resources. Yeah, but you could have stuck to resources on a world with interesting stuff on it, too. Yeah. Do you know what I'd really love? Is a proper, full-on update to Elite. Because I loved that game back in the day. It used to be awesome. Right, okay, I'm coming back to do whatever this quest is. And fuck my face, I could not see the way of getting from the Crystarium. Have you seen all the ads for uh, Star Citizen that have been popping up again on YouTube? Yeah. Oh, man. Uh, yeah, speaking of Todd Howard and selling games, you know, dozens of times to people. Um, <laughs> oh. All right, are we going to Amarang? Yes. Right, that's, what I was, I, that's what I was trying mm -hmm. to find, and I've just, just found out how to get there. Right, I'll meet you guys there. Roger, roger. But, my, you know, my major problem with modern game devs is that a lot of them have a serious lack of vision. Hmm. And it a lot of it gets chalked up to budgetary restraints. Yeah. However, I tend to be like, okay, but you could do this 20 years ago. And yeah, the yep. the games are a lot more complicated now. But still, there is some serious questions that need to be asked in regards to, is this money laundering? Yep. Uh, 
Yeah, uh, because that's, you that's see, a, that's a valid, that's a valid point. Definitely. You see games that sit in development for 20 years, like Grand Theft Auto, or you know, Scott, uh, Elder Scrolls Six, and you're like, guys, what are we doing here? Agreed. What's going on? I mean, I'm, I, I don't care what happens. I'm gonna buy Elder Scrolls Six probably. Unless like unless like Bethesda totally jumps the shark, you know, and goes full on, you know, you know, kicks out the last P. I'm I'm probably gonna look at Elder Scrolls Six because yeah. I really like the Elder Scrolls franchise, and yeah. you know I've been playing that for since forever. But the problem I have with a lot of this is the ambition behind a lot of these games is just missing. It's like, okay, we've got a... a open-world, third-person survival horror game, yep. number three, six, seven, eight, nine. Yeah, it's like, yeah, this has been done a million times. So I, I've, I've, got another, I've got another question. Uh, uh, well, it's, it's more another point, really. Um, because you, you are completely correct. What I find... And and there's only so many different ways you can skin a cat. Let's let's say there's that that is true. But the big problem I have with a lot of games is that they're failure to innovate. They're not bringing anything new. Well, there's... my problem is not just that it's a failure to innovate. It's they throw out the old stuff that worked. Yes. They don't learn from the mistakes of old. You know, Final Fantasy has stuck to a fairly similar formula since 13. I'm out of mind. Yeah. And, you know, they haven't really tried to do anything new. And the problem I've had with Bethesda is that Bethesda since uh, Morrowind hasn't had branching endings. Okay. In Daggerfall, you have like six different endings mm -hmm. that, I, that I've, I think, played. But you, you have, you know, it, Dagger, is, <sighs> Morrowind has one ending. Oblivion has one ending. Skyrim has one ending. You know, the ending for Morrowind is eventually, no matter what your choices are in the game, or, you know, no matter what you do, you're going to wind up eventually, you know, you're going to become the Nerevar, you're going to, you know, eventually sail over to the Nerevarine and sail over to Akavir and disappear from the pages of history. If you're the... Hero Kavat, you're eventually going to become Sheagorath. If you're the Dragonborn, you're eventually going to become Mirax Slave. You know, and that's, uh, uh... It's like, yeah, so... Can't we go back to when we had, like, six different endings for the main character? And the reason they can't do that is because they've made the main character the main character of this entire setting. A lot of RPGs suffer from this, you know? If you make the main character too important, they're unable to go and do anything else besides the main story. At the end of the story, well, okay, congratulations. Either the main character dies, or, you know, he just, poof, gone. Because, uh, or we wrote him out. You know, and it doesn't leave a whole lot of room for player agency. Now, games that try to get around that are like Dragon Age, but, you know, even there, you know, shoehorns in. Now, I've heard that Baldur's Gate 3, I haven't played it yet, but I've heard that Baldur's Gate 3 has multiple endings, which kudos to Larian for that. There are multiple endings, and that can yep. be confirmed. There are 17,000 different ways you can go through Baldur's Gate 3 and complete the game. And there's also a, they also added a epilogue just uh, towards the end of the year that wasn't in the game. It's like the Citadel in uh, Mass Effect Three. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. You know, I. <clears throat> and speaking of absolutely awful games that ruin franchises, um, Andromeda. One of the big problems is Mass Effect. You know, with the Mass Effect franchise that I, you know, that I didn't like was. Mass Effect 1 was an RPG. Light. And every game after Mass Effect 3, well, Mass Effect 3 trimmed out the RPG elements more and more. Yeah. So yeah, eventually yeah. you got our, you know, 
hey guys, it's Gears of War, but you know, you have a little bit more agency than that. I yeah, fucking Jay, hated Gears doing? of War 5. <laughs> Jay Tapia's joined us. Jay. How you doing, buddy? I didn't Hello. like Gears of War 5. <laughs> Congrats yeah. on your uh, membership as well. Uh, courtesy of Bend Over. Yes, sir. Poor Mirren is waiting on us, I think. <laughs> yeah, uh, just trying to go around as fast as possible. No, I'm just waiting if you guys want to open the map or not. Yeah, I'm, I'm done. Yeah, yeah. I'm just handing in all of these bits of food or whatever we're supposed to be doing. Supplies. Stupid quest. Fetchy McQuesty. Fetchy mm. McQuesty, yeah. Fetchy McBollico. Oh, dear, 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 dear. Oh, yes, 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 yes. Mirren, when are you going to start streaming? <laughs> Next week? Uh, Good job. When you sit down and uh, explain it to me in a more easier pattern. Cool. <laughs> that can't be Inst that hard, mate. Inst install OBS in the meantime. Will do. Don't go, don't go Streamlabs mm -hmm. OBS because you'll have a bad, uh, bad time. Hey, Mirren, <laughs> if an idiot like me can figure it out, you can probably do it just fine. <laughs> cool, thanks. <laughs> Mate. Hang on. We all, we're um, all part of the same retarded group. <laughs> well, to be fair, we all equally are retarded in our own unique ways, so it's fine. Yep. Apologies for being quiet, guys. I was just listening to the conversation earlier. Just in case you were wondering why I was not saying a thing, <laughs> I was just like, hmm, just listening in. Oh, yep. The problem, the, the problem, the problem I have with Bethesda's game design is, especially when it comes to Starfield, Starfield already feels dated when it came out. That that was the yeah. problem. That was my issue with Starfield. And it's, it's the same. It's the same fucking problem with modern gaming because, number one, we have th this massive problem that it, uh, we have unoptimized games now. Sp best example is the latest Jedi uh, Jedi uh, game from EA. Even the best computers couldn't fucking run it because it wasn't optimized properly, and that should that should worry people honestly because you, back in the day, we uh, especially in the nineties and early two thousands, people always had these benchmarks or developers had benchmarks. That you have to fulfill to actually play the game. Nowadays, you have Steam that can tell you, yeah, your computer can run this, or, uh, well, you will have a hard time actually running this. Well, you know why Jedi Survivor struggled to play, don't you? Um, I mean, it's, it's fairly obvious. It's because the lead character was fucking ginger. Mm. <laughs> well, so that, well, that's well, that's that's one of to be to be fair to, to be fair that's one of its faults. Yeah. That's one of its faults. Yeah, I'll give you that. I'm such a dick. Hey, not all of us are retarded. I'm an asshole. It's different. <laughs> well, yeah. if you say so, Rick. If you say so. I'm trying to find this last fucking... ...item and I can't fucking find it. Which one? For the... For the to hand in? For the supplies, you mean? Yeah. It's um one of these weird of chests from the merchants. Them, I think you're not too far off from. I think you're not too far off, mate. There's like this one guy over there where the chariot is. Yeah, I think that one. So this one, one, I did this one just after you did it. Have you tried the one on the left? To the to your left now. I'll find out. Out of curiosity, has anyone noticed anything yeah. weird with the algorithm on YouTube? Yes. Yeah, oh, it's been been strange lately. It's Mate, been, I... Updates have been very fucking slow as well. Or like, or uploads have been very fucking slow lately. Very well, fucking had, slow. I haven't had that problem, but I have had I have something else. What's so that? I'll upload a video, okay? <clears throat> and it will get no views for like the first couple of hours, and yep. then out of nowhere. I'll get like 600 views in the space of like 30 minutes. Right, okay. I think I can answer that because I've noticed that with my shorts and the um, the live streams. Because what I'm finding is that they are updating on a six to eight hour process. Yep. Yep, so that's, that's the, yeah, that's the, yeah, that's the thing. I, I upload right. I've got a, I've got on on my phone. I can see that one of my so one of the live streams 
where is it? One of the live streams, uh, views. So this was me playing World of Warcraft yesterday. Um, 77 views, whatever it may be. Watch time hours, 57.4. Um, but that 57.4 didn't go actually get counted to anything until it was like six and a half hours, seven hours, seven hours later. And I'm like, where the where the fuck is all that come from? Because obviously looking at your phone on studio and then looking at the analytics, it didn't compute. But if you if you look at the finer detail, it seems to be like every eight, I would say it's probably every six, six, twelve, eight and twenty four. That would make sense. So every six hours, they're running a job routine that says, "How many doodars update the um, update the channels?" Because if you're doing it live all the time, that's a lot of fucking horsepower. Yep. If you chunk a job by every six hours, it's updating regularly enough for most people. Um, and I wouldn't be surprised if it's also based on the number of viewers you've got. So if you've mm -hmm. got um, 500 viewers you are tied to an eight hours if you've got 500,000 you are tied to one hour if you're tied if you're over a million then you're down to 10 minutes it wouldn't surprise me it wouldn't surprise me and certainly if i designed something like that that's how i would design it honestly it's a priority queue in a way isn't it yeah it is i wouldn't waste um processing power no disrespect I wouldn't waste processing power on giving people under um, 10,000 subs live data constantly. I just wouldn't do it. Mm. I don't, that'd, I, that'd I would be a waste. Sounds legit. I'd give, them, I'd give them all of the appearance that it's live, but I wouldn't mm. actually update the information for eight hours. Because That's, yeah. are they really going to fucking raise a support ticket and say, I don't seem to be seeing my stats update regularly? And then you look at the T's and C's and you find out that only certain accounts can actually raise a call for live um, live KPIs and chart information. Mm -hmm. And you'll probably find they're paying a premium for it as well. Oh, well, half the time they probably just YouTube get wants to force because... people to get premium or pushing very hard to get pre people to buy premium. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm just handing this place um, down the bottom of these stairs. Tessaline. I presume you've done this one, Smith. Yes. Yeah. Cool. That's why right. I said Immutant's car, because I was like, hmm, I'll, I'll just wait. <laughs> okay, okay. testicles. We are done. <whistles> Fucking love that song. It's probably my favorite jingle from 15. Get in the car. <laughs> what us this rate the retarded capture? Yes. Psycho what is Mongoose, this? Yes. DSP, um, Smooth Bru, and more Smooth Snort. Snort. Oh, Smooth Smooth Mexican. Mexican. Smooth Mexican. I did. I did update. Did update the map. Let me open up the map so you can see it. There you go, my dude. And yes, we are still live, Ed. Yes. Still live. Live radio four from the UK. Tell me if you see any. Um... Ether. Yes, sir. We'll see. We'll tell you. I'm going to put the map over there so I can just spin the camera around and look. I did pick up one next to the bridge as we were coming across to this area. Really? I didn't, I didn't yeah. see one there. Okay. Um, so there's definitely one. If I was to look at the map of... Just place a marker if you need to. It's fine. Uh, I can open up the ether map again. Take me a second. Yeah, the flag that I place is the next quest ob objective I have. So yeah. that's no big deal. Christ, and, Tommy, and look at the... the... Huh? And one of the things that bothers me about a lot of modern game devs is they'll tell you they're not able to do stuff. And mm -hmm. then you have the Overwatch. <clears throat> Overwatch. Yeah. <laughs> and then you have the modders come in and do some crazy project like Beyond Skyrim. Have you guys looked into oh, that there's at one, all? There's one. Yes. Left. Stop. Yeah, stop. Yeah. stop. stop. That's Have you yeah. seen what those guys are doing? It is ridiculous. It's just like the Fallout London mod, isn't it? Yeah. Um, that that one's pretty, pretty ridiculous. Making all of Tamriel. The th the thing the thing is the problem I've got with 
that kind of situation. I, and I love modding. I will support modders to the day I die because at the end of the day, they get the opportunity to change the game in a way that works better, proof of life, additional this, that, and the other, whatever it may be. Love modding. But we shouldn't be in this position where game developers say, oh, we're not going to fix it. Fuck it. We'll leave it for the modders. No, they shouldn't be. And the other right. thing is, if the modders, you know, this is why I think you have, like, Capcom going after them. Um, it's because modders make them look bad. Yeah. Because, yeah. Mo you know, modders are over here. Guys area? Hmm? I got my... no, nothing around this area? Nope. Don't see one. Don't see you one. Know, modders um... over here making, like, all of Tamriel and Skyrim's engine. Now, it's not, you know, to scale as it is in the lore, but it is you know, to scale to Skyrim's map. So, you know, it's big. Mm. And yeah. they're fairly far along. And you also have the fact that they, they uh, which is part of why I think what Bethesda <laughs> did with the whole, oh, whole uh, hey, we're making a Oblivion remake, guys. And yep. the modders were already doing that. Mm. And they it's were the doing it arguably better. See, um, now, I don't know if they're gonna do it on on. on uh, I don't know if they're gonna do it on Creation Engine Two, the whole official one. But the unofficial one they were doing on Skyrim, uh, on Skyrim Engine, and it still looks great. Yeah. Mm. The Sky Oblivion mod. <clears throat> Rexus is raising a good point with Overwatch, though. So you he played Overwatch One pretty hard, so he never touched Overwatch Two, and, and he's pretty mad that they deleted the entire game to tell him to play the same game remastered with more predatory cash shop. Yeah, and twenty dollar micro microtransactions. Yep. Hang on, there's a. All I think I, I think I forgot to. Can, can we just go back real quick, please? And um, yeah, the th I mean the, th the thing is they made it free to play, obviously, and uh, they noticed that they, they they need to get out of the Blizzard launcher to actually get more people to play it. I need to go to the. Hang on. Uh, to the right. Shit. Just yeah. to the right. There's this Straight. destination Straight. thing. Yeah. Straight. Yeah, I've got it. Go. It's okay. I'll do. Thank you. And, um, yeah, they made it free to play, but th therefore you have to pay like 20 bucks to get a skin, which is pretty fucking yeah. ridiculous if you really think about it. I mean, granted, I made the upgrade from 1 to 2, so it's not as bad, luckily. And I kept all my characters that I unlocked, and thanks to a uh, little. Uh, exploit in uh, the Microsoft ecosystem, I actually unlock the heroes for free that that, came, that come new to the game. Which is uh, pretty cheeky when you really think about it because uh, Microsoft owns B uh, Blizzard now. <laughs> yep. Wait, so what you got to got there, Tommy? Is that the quest, is it? Yeah. Okay. Now, the, the one thing that oh, yeah, I, the chick. Um, I was hoping that the Blizzard acquisition by... Microsoft would actually re-inject some kind of um, I'd into say that some, studio. Yeah, the the thing is, is that you, so I I played World of Warcraft ever since 2004, so I've got a lot of time invested in the game, and and it's a game I loved for fucking years. Now the problem is, is that it lost its way through the last certainly the last four expansions. It fucking horrifically lost its way. And it didn't ever need to. And I'm just hoping that the acquisition just allows the team to actually go back to its roots. I mean, we've got Metzen who's just come back in the role that he was in. Um, I just really, really, really hope it goes back to its roots because I don't want a game like that to just implode because obviously I've got a lot of time invested a lot of feelings mm -hmm. invested myself and the wife played it continuously of course. good friends good relationships built through it so you never want to see something destroyed but obviously well, there's it's, a ether it's thing the worry yeah. that that's gonna happen um yeah. ether current just blow us yeah. um so I'm, I'm really hoping that the acquisition just gives the ch the teams the ability to go back to their roots understand what made classic great what made TBC great, what made Wrath of the Lich King great, and just re implement those same things. Just 
Here's, here's also a, cra a crazy idea. Why not bring back the classic versions of games and not force people to play the remastered versions? Because people were really pissed when Warcraft 3 got the original Warcraft 3 got nuked for the reforged version, and you were basically yeah. stuck with reforged. Yeah, reforged should never have been in the position that it replaced the um, the other. Now, the thing is with when when Blizzard did classic and um, TBC and RAF and whatever, everyone replayed it, and massive amounts of people replayed it because it was fucking awesome. Um, now the problem, the problem, the problem we then had is, oh yeah, Ether Current just well right, is that the retail version was so casually active, as in, no disrespect to move, I'm just going to pick on you right now. Um, so you could pick up World of Warcraft, you could start playing World of Warcraft. You'd be full level within 10 days without having had any playtime previously with the game. You would be max level and they would be throwing ma almost max level equipment at you straight away. Because what they've done is they've cut down the time to learn and time to achieve massively to yep. force people right into end game, which is the current content the people are avoiding the whole grind of the game for what it was originally known for and the story and the lore of course um but where hey, we think that they've massively failed you're right Mesa. by the way uh, where they where i think they massively failed was by making it too casual yeah there's no sense of achievement anymore far so too, uh, too in, casual yeah back, i mean you look at the gear mm. we've got now um, in World of Warcraft, you've got grey, you've got greens, you've got blues, then you've got purples, then you've got legendaries. So when you've got g nothing but green gear, and you suddenly get that first blue, you feel fucking powerful. You feel like you've achieved something. You've got your first blue, it's a massive upgrade, uh, and then you go through, you're earning the rest of your blues because you're doing dungeons and whatever it may be, uh, and then you get your first epic, and then your first legendary, and so on and so forth. Um, mm -hmm. The the issue we've got with the game is, I I've just leveled a brand new character, and he's almost fully decked out in epics. He hasn't mm -hmm. done anything. He's he's just done a few random quests. Right. This this the loot's been thrown at you. The reputation is thrown at you. They just want you into the end game as quickly as possible. Mm -hmm. There is fucking fifteen years. In fact, no, there's 20 years of gameplay or areas to explore and do stuff in that's completely skipped over, completely ignored, wasted. They should have left the, they should have left the skill requirements as they are. Um, where the fuck are we? Oh, we should be going the other way. Should be huh? going this way for the... Oh, I thought um, there was a current, a current here. Is there? Mm, should be, I'll see. Can't see it. I'm gonna get I'm the. Checking, I'm checking the caves. Water. I'm just. Yeah, yeah, that's cool. I'm just gonna grab the ether crystal because I'm normally the one who forgets it every time. Oh no, I know where we are. Fuck. Never mind. Dickhead. Um, let me reapply. Yeah, so the grind is what World of Warcraft. Trying to pick up smell. Yeah. Hmm? yeah. I'm the just, grind just walking towards it. Is what the game needs. The grind is what everyone moans about, but the removal of the grind is what fucked it over. We should all be grinding in these games because it ties us to the games. It makes yep. sure we can't just race through to the end and miss content. This gives, it gives us a sense of accomplishment content. too when we when yeah. we beat it. A hundred percent. You want that, to it, Rick and Rick is pointing so, out something in the chat. So didn't mean to cut you off for me. Yeah. Um, he says I think maybe GTA Five or the last Batman Arkham game might have been the last great franchises. Both get free too, I guess. Well, I didn't like GTA Five. Uh, but that's that's more, more part to you if you like it because I feel like that game was. Uh, not as good as 4, but then again, 4 wasn't that much better either. But I've, I enjoyed 4 a lot more than 5, game from a gameplay this perspective. Is, this is something that I think a lot of people are 
perhaps incorrect on. Just because you have... Sec Go ahead. It's just taking a second. This is fucking gay. No, I want I want the sense of achievement. I want to spend. I want the game. I think that to hmm? respect my time. Sorry, yeah. Pete, you cut out. Absolutely, Absolutely. you cut out. Absolutely. Absolutely. Um, I think that if you, you know, I don't think that just because the old studios are going the way of the dodo. Because here's the thing. Companies over over time tend to, and this applies to anything. You can see this with Disney. You can see this with Warner Brothers. You can see this with Blizzard. You can see this with Bethesda. They are kind of sort of reaching the end of their rope creatively because they either A, got rid of all the people who were creative and replaced them yeah. with in the case of Disney, they replaced them with stunning and brave. And in the Less case talented of the people. Stop, stop. Um, just below us, to the left-hand side, there's an Ethernet. The Ether Crystal, just to the left, next to the... I see it, yeah, on the rock, on the rock, yeah. Yeah. So on the left, left, left. Turn to nine o'clock. On the same level as the train tracks, my friend. Yep, right there. Yep, right there. Perfect. Thank you. And Sorry to interrupt in... you there, Pete. Oh, it's fine. There, and in the case of, say, you know, Blizzard, you have a lot of the problems with, you know, Blizzard has its own, you know, massive amounts of drama, but they have consistently pissed people off. Yes. In the fan base, the whole, uh, hey, do you not have phones? Do you guys not have phones? Yeah. Diablo Immortal. You know. Oh boy. Agreed. Yeah. yeah. And the, the thing is, I don't think that just because you have, you know, the the old major studios going the way of the Dodo, that that means that the entire industry is going that way. Um, a young, a fairly young studio that I'm interested in, I bought their, uh, I bought Greedfall. I don't know if any of y'all played with that, but it's kind of like, a, it's kind of like a Bioware era, like early Bioware Mass Effect slash Dragon Age yeah, thing. Right. It's pretty good. Uh, and, I mean, I'm not a massive... I prefer first person for combat for most things. Which, you know, I'm a weirdo that way. I know a lot of people don't like that, but I do. Um, it doesn't mean you're so, a weirdo, though. I mean, I can, I can kind of get it because it's, from an immersion standpoint, it makes more sense to have combat in first person. Especially when it's like uh, you playing a character. I know a lot Thank of people you. are dunking on like like um, friggin' Indiana the Indiana Jones game, right? I can see why people are shitting on it, and I've been one of those people shitting on it because I th think it's a dumb idea to make an Indiana Jones game in first person. That's just me though. Hmm. Well, but the thing. like for from I a would think it for from an immersion standpoint, like if you have games like Dishonored or friggin' Skyrim or Fallout, and these games can be enjoyed in both third and first person mode. Well, so, here's the thing. I would prefer, since they have Creation Engine anyway, do both. Hey. Do yes. both. Give people yep. the option to do both. Yep. You yep. Know? And they, they're like, oh, we're going to do like third person for certain things, which, you know. Hey, the first person is great for me, but there are other people who don't like it. And I would just, I would prefer if you could have both, you know, because there are certain people who really like third person for everything. Amazing. And then there are people like me who like, you know, I like third person for like when I'm traversing the map because, you know, <coughs> it's hurting. <laughs> um, yeah. It's made my brain do mouth. Shitty. Hey, well, how's it going? Oh, I'm gonna go for a piss while you Hello. while you doing this. Yeah, I need to I need to go for a break, break real quick as well. Once once Mirage has landed. <laughs> so I'll leave you guys with this. Uh... Be right back, guys. Just give me a minute. Yeah, same. I need to go for a pee as well. Well, fo focus the idle cam on uh, Mirage for the time being. What? 
zombie. Oh, wait, a zombie and me are standing literally in, in each other, so that's gonna be difficult. All riding on you, man. Yeah, let's do this then. There you go. I'll be right, right. back, guys. Ooh, Psychotic Mongoose gifted a membership to the stream to Tracy. Oh my. Yeah, Tommy, you oh accidentally my. played the outro. <laughs> what is he doing? And Mirden is doing his uh, moonwalk routine there. F going full on Michael Jackson right there. Hee <laughs> hee! I'm just messing you. With you. Do -do. As you do. As you do. Yeah, I mean, I'll, I'll be honest with you guys. I'm very skeptical when it comes to a lot of modern games, and Rax has raised a good point with the Overwatch thing. The, the, what, what What's the most heinous shit about the whole Overwatch ordeal is that they force p uh, shops to get rid of the original game discs so people cannot get the advantage of actually having the full game, uh, the, all the characters beforehand. Because um, for a time being you have this um, character rotation thing going on that you have like certain heroes that you can play in the, in the free to play version. And that, that's what really annoys me because Imagine if, if you were a day one Overwatch player from back in the day when the game was very, very fucking popular. Then Blizzard comes in and says, nah, this, this is not, you don't own this anymore. Or, or they actively take away skins from you just to resell them to you for, uh, for a higher value, even though you had loot boxes where you unlock these fu uh, friggin' things before. That would really piss me off, honestly. And, um... I got one good example of a free game that actually works currently, or has a has the free to play and the buy the full thing, and that's the um, Grand Blue Fantasy that I'm currently playing. I've got the full version, but there's also a free version where the granted it is a fighting game, but um, you have a rotation of characters that you can play every once in a while, and and I think it's like every week the roster rotates for you, and I think it's pretty good if you make it that way. So, so you give a bit of a variety to the people that are playing it. Granted, if you pay full price for it, you should be expected to have the full roster of character, the characters available to you. The, the, the big issue I have with modern gaming is, though, that um, a, a lot of um, companies have this thing of... Um, well, how should I call it? Hubris, I think, because they they think they can do no wrong, and that's where where Blizzard sh uh, shat the bed quite uh, quite frankly, because they thought they could could get away with making a sequel and make the other one not playable anymore, mm -hmm. instead of just keeping the the uh, this, the prequel alive and then having the sequel run at the same time. Still, I mean, let's be let's be real. Overwatch 2 is basically a 2.0 patch for the original Overwatch. It looks prettier, it looks, it runs a bit better, but it's essentially the same fucking game. And now they came up with this genius idea of um, wanting to give all the heroes healing abilities, which in my opinion is frig friggin' dumb, but that's just me. But, um, yeah, that's, that's just how it is. It's sheer fucking hubris, yeah. And, uh... What chance does a young studio have with the current environment of crayon-headed weirdos, ESG and DEI? We are, we as players will lose every time. And th that's the thing. You have to... Th that's where indie comes in, in my opinion. Because I think the indie market is a goldmine for this kind of shit. Because you can, you can get games that you oh. uh, were yearning for. I mean, granted, there's a, there's a few plants there that... Um, or, well, industry plants that can fuck it up for, for you, but... Uh, the, granted, there's, there's a few gems there, still. You remember the, you know, absolute head exploding, exploding awesomeness that was uh, Kingdom Come Deliverance. Um, I I heard of it. I never played it myself though. Yeah. <laughs> but that, I the, that game made the purple hairs and the blue check marks on Twitter absolutely lose their minds. Because, uh, yeah. So the main cast is very uh, Caucasian. Yes, that's what uh, mid middle medieval Europe was, though, at the time. Yeah, it's medieval Hungary, and uh, 
the guy who was developing it at the time uh, really ticked him off because he got into a debate with this guy who was interviewing him on IGN and he was like, you know, uh, well, he's like, where, where are the, where's the diversity? And he's like, it's medieval hungry. Yeah. And then you have to push uh, back on this shit. Don't yeah, even give them f a fucking inch anymore. Just tell them to fuck off and, and that's it. And that's something I think Baldur's Gate kind of messed up on with the uh, latter day inclusion of all the, uh, <clears throat> well, yeah, no. Modern day bullshit. <clears throat> Welcome back. Welcome See, back. See, uh, Psychotic Mongo is also raises a good point. Destiny took original uh, and DLC content uh, players uh, paid for away from them. Zombie kick uh, one went down again. Uh, it did. There you go. It's cash has been re kicked. Um, what I was just about to say. Oh, there he is. Uh, there you go. Look at that light part. Hey, what Cash. How's it uh, going, man? Um, Psychotic <laughs> Mongoose gifting one membership to the channel. But Tracy Greg. Reeves received. Well, that that was on my end. You, you, what, yours, yours went to Greg. <laughs> uh,. Oh, yeah. Yours went, to, <laughs> your, fucking yours went to Tracy. Mine went to Greg Philip. Yeah. Um, chair, shush. You will get banned. And the chair. And the chair. Mm -hmm. Hey, Cash. How's it going? You know what, Cash? How's things? Um, I should... I should Do you have Cash on the Discord, mate? Um, I don't think Cash has joined our Discord. No, you should. <laughs> Join us, Cash. Yeah. <laughs> um, so, uh, Cash, if one if, of us, one if of us. If you're, if you're listening, Cash, just jump into um, my description on the video. There's a link tree link there. That will give you access to Discord. Once you're in Discord, just jump into one of the gaming channels, and I'll give you the necessary rights, and then pull you into the channel. Feel free, mate. You're more than welcome anytime. More than welcome. I don't know if he heard that, but if he did, then good. <laughs> yeah, it's, gonna, it's gonna be at least 30 seconds because of the video. Yeah. It depends on yeah. if he's watching any content. I mean, he must be watching us because he joined us, <laughs> after all. Yeah. Or did you invite he, him, Mirden? I invited him, he just popped up, so I invited him. Mm, fair yeah. enough, yeah. He's probably gonna be surprised that we're at level 76 already. <laughs> he's gonna be like, oh, really? <laughs> he's showing off his uh, new scythe. Ooh. Oh, he's a uh, Dark Knight, isn't he? Uh, or Reaper? He's a, Reaper. He's a Reaper. A class that will be uh, introduced in Endwalker. To us, mm. I think. Wasn't it? Wasn't it Endwalker? Uh, oh. yeah, Endwalker. There's Cash. Cash is there. I do. I'm just, w just waiting to see him hit. In fact, no, I can do it already. Uh, Cash. Rolls. Tombies. Privileged Tombies. Streaming Tombies. Yeah, so Cash, you should be able to just jump straight into the um, gaming channel. There he is. Hello. Hello. Hello yeah. Cash, how are you doing, fella? Hola. Hola. Como te llamas? Me llamo Bob. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Cash, how's it going? How are you doing? Yeah. It's been a while, huh? Oh, oh yeah, it has. It has been. It's been, a, been a couple. It's been a minute. It's been a minute. I mean, how many months has little, it been? Little uh, sprouts got their uh, their level 75, 76 going on. Yeah. When do we get rid of those sprouts, by the way? When does uh, that happen? I think you have to reach on Walker. Oh, okay. <laughs> wow. Hey, I reached level 77 just now. Woo! Nice. Lock nice. it in. Yay. Wait, right, I'm just going to meet up with you guys so I can actually, actually join you here. What the hell? <laughs> Fields of Amber. Oh no. Don't let Amber Heard hear that. Jesus Christ. Oh, God. Fields of Amber Turd. I, yes. I had to say Poppy out, and Poppy was dropping fucking the biggest logs ever. <laughs> My God, the fucking stump. I was like, crying out loud. That's dog shit for you. The dog having a shit. That's dog shit for you, though, mate. But, but the thing is, is, obviously, she's giant breed, so she has giant shits. So yep. Jesus, I'm gonna be breathing that in for a week. Since we're a party of four, do we want to do wondrous tales? I'm wondering. 
Uh, did you guys already grab them? Or? I, gr I grabbed a new one in yeah. last stream because you told us to get get one. <laughs> but we, I don't, oh. don't think we got around <laughs> to it. <laughs> yeah, we can. We can uh, um, I burned mine already this week, but I can, I can do your guys's. That's a cool weapon you got there, Cash. <laughs> yeah, the latest relic weapon. Nice. Look, look, oh, that looks, oh, fuck, that looks bad, badass. <laughs> that uh, fucking mobs just disappeared. Wondrous Tales. Wait, you want to go first, Tommy? Want to tell the good, good, funny gentleman what you have? Um, well, line number one is the standard. The um, usual so shit. To line number three. So, yes. Bowl of Embers Extreme. Same. Striking yeah. Tree Extreme. Uh, don't have. Ak, Afar, Amphibus I've got that one. Theater, yeah. Extreme and the Minstrel's Ballad. Okay, that's Ultimate interesting. Name. We have the same three in one row, and then I've I've got Thorn March, Limitless yep. Blue, Binding Core of Bahamut Turn One, uh, Second Coil of Bahamut Turn Three. Uh, I also got Treasure Dungeons Alexander, Weeping City of Mark, and the World of Darkness. Alright, so what's the one next to front lines? Mm. Uh, that's the second row. call of Bahamut. Second call of Bahamut turn three for me. And then for Tombi? Uh, which one, sorry? Next one that's over. The... Next to the front lines, the, the flag. Coil turn four. Cash, you want to you wanna run with us, buddy? Uh, sure, I'll be healer. Cool. Oh, we're going to do it on sync, so... Oh, yeah. okay. <laughs> <laughs> that, should, that should be fine. <laughs> so that was Man, we got a party of four. Right, that's, that's, right, guys, group post. I need a picture of this because this is a rare moment that we actually have a party of three, of four. <laughs> Hang on, where, where uh, do we get rid go? of the? Uh, should we get rid of the birds or? Um, probably a good idea. Yeah. Hang on a second. Uh, minion. Oh no, no, fucking minions. Go away. Um, uh, companion. Get the fuck out of here. No. Go away now. Go away now. There you go. Fuck it, you buy it. Cameras out. Uh, let's see. Come with oh, Hang on, I need to put gold in the middle because I'm the tiniest one. Move a bit closer, Tommy. Yep, perfect. Yep, perfect. Hang on a sec. Oh, oh. Everybody's weapons out? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh my god, that looks badass. That looks fucking cool. Yeah, thanks, guys. Perfect. Uh, that's the gonna be the thumbnail for the stream, I think. Perfect. Right. Shall we then, gentlemen? Alright, so we'll start with turn four. Yes, sir. That's gonna be fun. All I can smell is dog shit. Ugh. Dog shite. Yeah, it's really fucking strong as well. It's beginning to smell a lot like dog shite. Everywhere do you go. Boom, boom. Okay. I need to zoom out again. Because <laughs> the camera was so far up my own ass there. Boop, boop. Let's go. It's a, oh no! Oh no! Oh no, oh no, oh no. Fuck it in, yay. Still gonna drop them around the edge, cash. So if you get targeted, just everybody start running around uh, counterclockwise. Counterclockwise. Okay, gotcha. Yep. Owie. That was close. Mm -hmm. And then the green ones in the middle. Uh, in a circle. Pick a circle. Good, good, good. Okay. Oh, Hi. Mega Flare. 
Oh, that, that was cute. Get out of the middle, get out of the middle. Have you, have you seen how long Az has been streaming? Yep. <laughs> Fucking insane. <laughs> that man is an absolute beast. I wish I had the mental fortitude to stream as long as he does sometimes, but I'm my brain can only process like so much. Sleep. Yeah, I appreciate I my sleep just, a bit too much. I've just, I've just got too many other things to do because obviously being married and having a house, dog. Yeah. You got a life. You I want, would, you I would literally things. stream all, all day. I could probably do it. I would probably do it. <laughs> Easy. Yeah, I'm going to have to bounce off here around 7 because I got to go milk. Yep. <laughs> You gotta go milk. Oh my. Yeah. I am. Cow. You, cow. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> yeah, no. The next one for Samu? Uh, just a second. What'd you think I meant, you weirdo? What do you mean? Milk in the cat. Second coil of Bahamut turn three. And turn, turn one. Three. Uh, binding coil of turn one. Alright. Man, this music is so fucking chill. I love it. Doom, 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 doom. Compared to the Stormblood stuff, <laughs> I'm kind of glad we, we're out of Stormblood now because I just want to get some uh, Shadowbringers go, go, going because I heard the expansion is pretty good and uh, I want to play it. Can you believe it, Tommy? We managed to get through all the all the stuff already and we're at Shadowbringers now. Kind of nuts. Yeah, fucking crazy. And I checked my Steam. Uh, I think we o I'm over 240 hours now in the game. Fucking mental, I mate. I don't think I'm that far at that, that amount yet. I'm trying to decide, trying to remember which way to go here. <laughs> well, that's okay, don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Don't stress it, we've got time. I'm gonna go up Ooh. again. Oh, shit. Yes! Ah, oh, that's what they're <laughs> calling it. Hello. Now. I love the run cycle of, of my character. <laughs> Even after two, over 200 hours, it looks funny. Is this guy's arms up and he's like... Tick, 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 tick. It would have been like, funny if I could just pick him up and carry him underneath my arm. <laughs> that would have been fucking funny. You can carry me piggyback. <laughs> yeah. Ah, here it is. Easily. Me. Boop. Right. Uh, be careful doing heavy damage on this guy. Let him get like a couple seconds into it. Oh yeah, it's this uh, this guy. Oh, yeah. No heavy damage, you say? Okay. Oh, this is the fucker that one shot me that one time. I remember him now. <laughs> Yep, that's what that's gonna happen. I knew it. <laughs> now you guys should be able to do some wild damage. Why am I attacking you? Oh, fuck, I'm confused. Okay. Mm -hmm. Don't. Sorry about that. <laughs> Tommy from raids. This one, what? Daily dysfunction in Tommy's chat. Hello. Uh, bear with me, Koa. I'm just trying to find my fucking. Yeah, there is. Oh, daily dysfunction. How you doing? How you doing there? Hello there. What have you been up to, my friends? What have you been up to? Oh, that was fun. Let me know when the yes. next one's up. So, what are you saying, Smooth? Some revenge is in order. Yes. Absolutely, mate. Absolutely. Next would be uh, Tommy. Yes, sir. Right. As soon as I've left, I'll let you know. Ah, uh, so what has Daily Dysfunction been doing on this fine Saturday? What have you been doing? Uh, binding coil, turn three. Binding coil. Turn one. Turn three and then turn one. Okay. Yep. <clears throat> so what yes. you're saying is smooth some revenge is in order. Yes, yep. it is. The Always. sun's getting real low, big guy. Big guy. Yep, and it is. To daily dysfunction. I mean, it's almost 2 a.m. for me. Yeah, That's okay. Nice. 
it's, it's getting quite Jeez, late. Boo. Hey, I'm a trooper. You know me, guys. <laughs> I mean, I've got a stream coming up in about eight hours, but that's okay. No, it's my fault, mate. <laughs> I mean, we, we're reaching the... Uh, let's see here. How long have we been streaming? Probably three or four hours now, right? Three Nearly. hours I got on like... Oh, three. Wow. Wow. It's been that long already. Wow. Oh, wow. Cash, you always more than welcome to join us if you if you are available. Yeah, <laughs> just know whenever, that, yeah. Whenever, whenever you want to play, you just and we're just on let us know. Just, just, yeah, just hop on. I usually I usually never see you guys online. So. <laughs> yeah, it's it's a rare occasion that we're playing on Saturdays. Actually, usually that's the yeah. Tommy's Tommy and wife time. But nope, that's the wrong way. Sorry, guys. Is it? Oh, oh well, fuck it. <laughs> Weep. What can he buy? What can he buy? I noticed my I noticed that uh, people didn't like uh, the the fact that Mirdan got abducted by aliens last time because I made a short out of it and it's not doing so well. <laughs> um, the, the icing on the cake was the hello when when the idol cam was on. It's like hello. <laughs> That's yeah, where it cut uh, off. Daily, I, I think you'll find Abe's probably in Az's chat. Yep. I'll just have a look. Let me see if I can see. Him yeah, Abe's probably in Az Az's chat. It wouldn't surprise me if you wouldn't be. <laughs> A silent terminal. It's gonna give you the silent treatment, Batman. I've seen these platforms before. They were in Final Fantasy X. Because <laughs> I know, know the symbol with the arrow that was in X. I was in a freaking anime dungeon. Bump. Hey. Which way did you go? I don't know. Uh, we're just jumping through the circles. Okay. Wee. Like Sonic. <laughs> we're jumping through hoops. Gotta get those gold coins. <laughs> Gotta go fast. Wee. I think Cash just broke my shoulders. <laughs> he just landed on me. <laughs> <laughs> my shoulders! Oh, surprisingly, Abe's not in. Wow. Wow. Surprising. <laughs> yeah, Mark almost shit himself yesterday when he saw the 700 people come into his chat, what, right? <laughs> that was no, pretty funny. It, was my, it hit 950 uh, when, when the first transfer. Yeah, the, yeah 950, yeah. But, I, I was I was so pleased for him, and then he then he got a little bit upset that I said uh, like, share, subscribe after by the hour of him being online. Well, it was a bit weird. But where did you get upset? Their own. Um, as in, um, because I turned around and said, um, just obviously like, share, and subscribe the um, to the guys that came in. He's like, yeah, don't do that. I'm like, okay, I'm good, sir. Yeah, I don't know. I'll, I'll explain it offline and I just found it very weird. I get it. I think I know I, I did it. I mean, the thing is, he was he was explaining that, obviously, at the beginning of a stream, definitely don't worry about doing likes, shares, subscribes, and things like that, because, obviously, he would prefer people get to the end of the content, understand everything that's being delivered, and then subscribe to that, what, what they understand. But he'd been going for an hour. So, mm. as far as I was concerned, I thought it was a fair game, but I can understand the point, but I just thought it was a bit much to just call it out on stream. Yeah. Each their own, I guess. Yep. One day, we might have as many people follow us. Eventually. I hope that ever happens. <sighs> yeah, exactly. It is funny. I'm, I'm grateful for the man. people we have, honestly. So am I. I'm shocked to still be here. So, Davis, this function, don't think I've ever seen this game before. How is it? It's, it's, it's really weird. It's a That's good, enjoyable rad. game you can play with friends. Mm -hmm. um, I've certainly never had any regrets of picking it up and spending time playing it. Mm -hmm. um, it's challenging. You have to learn fucking constantly. 
You're leveling constantly. There's but that's so the thing, it keeps you on your toes. It keeps you on your yeah, toes, there's though. There's so much to do in this game. So much to do. It's really good. Um, for me, it is. it does have the equivalency of World of Warcraft. Both of them have got pros and cons, and both of them have got different pros and cons against each other. Um, yeah, it's well worth... Um, well worth uh, coming in. Oh, bend over. Come on. You've ben. got to stop that, my friend. <laughs> Daily dysfunction. <laughs> membership. Wouldn't you know? Just Daily. joined and got a membership. <laughs> Daily dysfunction gets a membership. That, that's very funny. Daily. That's some funny shit. <laughs> uh, let's see. Lo Lofty is going to be on Saturday Night Hypnosis. Oh, boy. Ooh. Lofty, huh? Ooh. Lofty was playing with his brother earlier. Now... I mean, the, th the thing is, is that Lofty rubs people up a l quite a lot. He does that deliberately. He does that deliberately. Yeah, of course he does. Of course he does. He's, he's bait, bait and That's trash. fucking Lofty. Yeah. And some of his, he likes, some he, of his... Lofty loves drama. Yeah, yeah, yeah he does. His parents, that fucking steel leg of history with the blurb of a cow move. And some of his points are valid. But the problem I find with Lofty is that when you counter his argument, he then goes for an insult rather than trying to challenge the challenge so I like well, lofty loves being a contrarian that's his problem yeah, i like i like to have a good conversation with people and challenge yep. their thoughts and feelings even my own i'm quite yep. happy to change my own mind um but i will challenge people on on theirs whether the opinion's correct or not or whatever have the proper discourse over them. Uh, but yep. the second you get to the point where Lofty is clearly losing an argument or losing a discussion, it then becomes an insult to the person, which is what I fucking detest in people. If people are so weak that they have to attack the person rather than the argument, then yeah, it's just, just bo fucking you are boring. Better than on scum, and basically you should be filtered out of existence. It's just it's just being fucking stupid at this point. Yeah. You know? Yeah. Well, me personally, I don't see any point in debating people on the internet because there's no incentive for them to be honest. Yeah. And also, yeah. at that point, you've got a ton of ego involved. Yep. Yeah. You know, usually, especially, like, watching any debates between big YouTubers, it's like nothing's, neither of you are going to be able to change because, you know, you've got thousands of people the watching. Bismarck Extreme, right, uh, Smo? Um... If it's the limitless blue, yes. <clears throat> you know, neither of you are gonna say, "Hey, I'm wrong on this." Yep, and Rick, well, Rick says it. Rick says it really well. Yep, if you can't debate facts, fuck, fuck your feelings. feelings. Yep. We might yeah. get a bird. Bird. Burb. Burb. Yeah, a burb. On oh, this fucking battle, yeah. <laughs> fucking whale. Well, I'm gonna punt. I'll see y'all. Uh, Tomorrow, I you, suppose. You take see care you tomorrow, dude. I'm looking forward to playing tomorrow with you. Yes, sir. You too. It's going to be chaotic, you know the times, but fun. We'll, we'll let you yep. know the times, buddy. Yep. Yep. Talk to y'all later. You later. Bye for now. Bye. Bye. What? No, we bye. said bye for now. Bye. No. Bye for now. <laughs> that's, that's what we said. Ciao for now, my friend. Ciao for now. Arrivederci. <laughs> And Dave 100%. It is okay to have different opinions. Yep. It is also okay to change your opinion. Based on facts. So it's also okay to change your opinions based on the facts. It's, it's also okay to not bother wanting to change your opinions. No one's forcing you to. But ultimately, if the facts show that you are incorrect, you should be brave enough to say, "Yeah, I'm I'm wrong on that. Let's change my stance." Yep. I've or got, admit I've that no you're wrong at least. Around. Yeah, I've got no problem turning around to someone and say, "Oh yeah, I'm wrong. My opinion is wrong, or my understanding is wrong." Time to time to learn. Time to do something different. It's okay to be ignorant Nothing sometimes, but admit that you're being ignorant. That's the, that's the thing. Here he comes. Yeah. He's breaching! He's breaching! It's the noise. That's, that's, that, that's a broken toilet right there. That's the sound <laughs> of a broken toilet. No, that's the sound of someone going to a Chrissy Mayer fucking convention. No! <laughs> 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 <laughs>
brutal. <laughs> Savage strike. Well, to be fair, uh, Farron can think of... Just ask Farron. He's been to a comedy special of uh, Chrissy's. First he arrived in Texas. Yeah, yeah. Boom. This marks Jesus' control of the clouds. Knock that. Ooh. Bad whale. Wow, <laughs> that was that was close. <laughs> I almost fell off. Almost. Man, man, yeah, man. Dragon kills are ready. Dragon killers ready! Contestants ready! <laughs> Three, two, one, go! <laughs> the course called Corona. <laughs> That's funny. Yep. Boom, uh, baby. Chrissy is damn funny and she has a very good comedic timing, except when oh. filing cabinet uh, was raw dogging her. An expense came. Oh, okay. No, no bird, though. No, no bird. No bird. Uh, I'm a dis dis disappointed. Uh, what's the next one on the list? Disproportional. Uh, Mr. Tommy's up next, I think. Mm -hmm. uh, Minstrel's Ballad, Borden's Reign, or Frontline? Uh, with the one on the very end on the right side. On the right side is Frontline. Oh, no. I'm sorry. Oh, no. Uh, the bottom one. Sorry. Uh, Thornton's Reign. Okay. Sorry. Yeah. Well, this will go much faster now that Cass Cash is here. Thank you. Oh, yeah. Like there fucking you go. <laughs> Insta Pop. Insta yep. Pop. This is great. That's great. That's good to have a party of four. It's fun. Yeah. We actually have a, an actual party of four. We could actually do dungeons normal. Wow. Race and throw. That's also true. That is true. Yeah. Actually, we could actually learn how to do dungeons. Yep. <laughs> we could. <laughs> or, we, or we don't. <laughs> <laughs> well, well, yeah, I mean, <laughs> that's a given. <laughs> you will succumb to the darkness. Drink deep of the power of slumbering gods. Well, this is your guys' first time on this one as well, isn't it? Yep. Uh, I believe so, yeah. Oh boy. Uh, run away from me, run away from me! Yes, I'm trying to run away. <laughs> Uh, yeah. <laughs> yep. Yeah. You were saying? We're supposed to get. We're supposed to be in the towers too, so we don't get paralyzed. Paralyzed. Da da da. See someone's good hat then. Yep. Boop. All right. Stay out of the. Uh... Stay out of the center. No, I mean, that goes without saying, right? <laughs> He's charging. He's charging. It's buttocks. Oh, shit. Fuck your face. Yeah, he did. Yep. Fucking murdered. <laughs> oh, he did. Look at that regen that Cash put on me. <laughs> Crazy. I know, it's obscene. I find your health, uh, health, uh, HP, uh, absolutely obscene as well. <laughs> Both me and Cash. <laughs> yeah. Don't be near me. Bum, 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 bum. Don't be near Tommy. Don't be close Damn. to Tommy. Did 
Are those Otherwise. supposed to be the knights of the round, by the way? Oh uh, yeah. Yep. Okay. <laughs> I thought as much because the, that move said looked oddly familiar. <laughs> I'm I'm curious how they're gonna pull off Knights of the Round in uh, Rebirth, by the way, if if they are actually in Rebirth. Because Knight. Well, you know, in in the original, is make a sandwich time when you cast them, because <laughs> it takes like three three or four fucking minutes to summon yep. them. And near the sword. This coming to the magical chopper. Get to the chopper. Oh, okay. Whoa, babe. Whoa there. Cash put so, so put super shields on us. We're not taking any damage. <laughs> I was just about to say, like, where, where's all the damage going? <laughs> Here we go. Let's go. Ultimate end. Yep, that works. So <laughs> Thanks for that. <laughs> oh, man. I'm going down, bitch. The, power of light. the king and die. Achievement no, unlocked. No burb. No burb? I'm disappointed. Da -da -da. Scholar's arm, though. Hmm. Cool. Let's get right. that. Row, row number two. Than a one row man. number two is. If I, I have Ifrit's. Or three. I think let's Ifrit. see. Uh, uh, we'll start from right to we'll go right to left. Uh, Ultima, uh, Shiva, King Mughal, and Bowl of Embers all in extreme, apart from uh, uh, Ultima's bane. All right, so you both have Ultima, so we'll take care of that one right now. Yeah. Yes, <clears throat> we've both got Bowl of Embers. That yeah, that is true. Well, we this, this one will be like eight seconds. <laughs> if I saw, I think last time we killed him in four. <laughs> Or even less? I don't even know anymore. It was very quick last time. Okay, gentlemen. <laughs> Start your engines. Go! Six seconds. Okay. That was quick. <laughs> hey yo! Well, we'll that's Shiva off. next. Ooh. Yes. Drink. Okay. Fuck your face. I need I need a little refrigerator up here. I want to just have a nice. Cold... I've been thinking about buying that Xbox Series X fridge, actually, <laughs> just, just for the lols. <laughs> as a mini fridge, yeah, just as a mini fridge here. Yeah. Let's go. I'm getting a fat ash back here. <laughs> oh, you got a chef, shit, you fat ass. <laughs> I mean, that goes without saying. <laughs> Boom, baby! Heebie-jeebies! Everybody do your favorite emote. Okay, I'm gonna dance. Do you wanna dance? I wanna Who dance! Is Who is she gonna step on? <laughs> Me! What's that really pose, Cash? Posed. Tommy, you're not in the middle. I don't care. Mm -hmm. Fuck your face. Uh, cast the, the event. Oh, I forgot the name. Is it the new one from the Flopperets? No, no, no. Oh no, the, the uh, oh, was the other event. The um, one on Gold Saucer. Yeah. 53 seconds. Yeah, baby. And no... Ice Deacon. Oh boy. No horse. No horse. I'm disappointed, man. No Phoebe Waller Bridge. I'm disappointed. Well, you got all the horses. I know. I know. I know. Oh, I know. Hang on. Right, let's redeem those two. Neat. Yeah, let me I almost got one row. Almost. I got almost one line. Almost. Almost one line. W which row do you All have, right. Tommy? Just out of curiosity. Uh, I'll do, uh... In terms of lines. Yeah. Uh, first line vertical. Hmm. I got second line uh, vertical. Oh, just one let's, more sticker. Let's do Bull of Embers. Yes. Good and shot. then we'll do uh, Mughal and then uh, Ramuf. Yes. Uh, Ifri shouldn't take long. Ding dong, the bit just dead. Six seconds. 
Surrender thyself to the fires of judgment. No pony. Of course. Do you know, <laughs> do you know that tweet I put out, Smoo? Uh, and, and the one that I mentioned right at the start of the stream. That yeah. Just for some strange reason is just getting hammered with loads of views. It's now gone up another 2,000. Damn. Okay. There's yeah, a 22,500 and... 20 uh, and 16,000 of that was today. <laughs> That's mental. <laughs> it's, it's been it's been there for like fucking 12 days. Someone must have said something in there. Someone famous must have said something. Tommy's running slower than a one-legged man, says Robert. Yeah, but he can suck a dick because he can't spell <laughs> caramel. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that goes with us. I mean, that's a given. It's got two A's in it, bud. Alright, so Smoo, you should be able to have seven now. And if you well, don't thanks. get a line, we should do some refreshing stuff. Yes, sir. Yes, yes sir. Let's see. Um, okay. Yep, um, got one row. Got one row. Steel leg. You got one row? Yep. Your face. Oh, then, then we keep <laughs> it. Yep. I, I got one row. Then we keep it and we move on to Tombies, which is. Yes. Striking, <clears throat> striking tree. Striking tree. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Oh, it's always Ramu. Ramu! Ramu. As always, guys, thank you for being here. Um, and for. I hope you guys enjoy the stream. And also, thanks to Mirden and Cash. Mirden is always for being a good sport about this whole thing. Yeah. <laughs> Wouldn't. I mean. Yeah, it certainly, certainly is a fucking sport, isn't it? Yep. It's gonna be nice Way to get us all up to uh, Criterion Dungeon level. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, yeah. And you bet your ass I'm gonna, gonna do the... Yeah. I'm, you bet your ass I'm gonna do the Yoha raids with you guys. We're gonna fucking the, do them. Uh, uh, near? Yeah, hell yeah. yeah. I wanna play oh, them. Oh, there's the Thunder Pony! Hey! Thunder Pony. I've, well, I mean, right. I've got it, so it's right. Tombies. I've got it. Apparently, what? I've got it. I've got a tick in it. Oh, that's weird. <laughs> Okay. All right. No pony for anyone then. <clears throat> and then that means Tommy, we check to see you see if you got a row, and if you don't, we gotta do some re refreshing. Yep. yep. We got a suck mess of a dick. I, I I got one, so that's good. Nope. I no row. To... That sucks. Right, so then both of you please reset. Um. Just a retry. Or right, for for Tommy, you uh do a shuffle. First. Yep. Yep. I've got. I've got one line. Oh, you did. Cool. Yep. Then uh, let's see here. Do you? You don't have the ice pony yet, do you, Tommy? Mm. Don't think he has. No. Then let's do uh, both of you reset on Shiva. Yes. We'll try to get that one for you. Okay. Uh, second chance on uh, which one? Sorry, Shiva. Uh, retry on Shiva, which is the Ak Afa uh, Amphitheater. Uh, Ak Afa, isn't it? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Ak Afa. There we go. Man, this music is so chill. <laughs> I love it. Oh yeah, Doom. it's fucking amazing. Uh, ben Dover says <laughs> Teletubby goes down. Oh we no. We used to have a joke. We also used to have a joke in um, Gospel where I used to live. There's a place called Rauner, which is like Liverpool, basically, everything gets stolen. Um, and we always used to say, is, what do you call a telly tubby in Rauner? And we always used to turn around and say, a tubby, because the telly's been stolen. Uh, it is still a good joke, but you, obviously you get... Most people probably don't even know what the fucking telly tubbies are anymore. Emotes for the win! V-Pose! My victory pose. Come on, squash me tits. It was the Fall Guy 7. Ah, oh, yeah, that's right. Nice. <laughs> okay, I left that pose. That I just had. I love that music drop when you shift snaps her finger. Pony! There's a pony! The true ice musket on. I don't have that pony. Do you have that pony? I have them all, mate. I have them you all. You have mate. them all. Right, okay. Yep. Okay. 
of so ingredients. You like feel free to get that one. Cool. Alright, and then uh, so check your boxes. See if you might get, uh, see if you can get close to a second line. Hmm, be good. I've got a good chance to, to clear two rows actually. Let's see. So have I. Nah, so fuck it. <laughs> nah. Nope. No luck. No luck. No. Right. Nah. What we got? We got Weeping City of Mark. Oh fuck that one. Uh, uh, Alexander. No, we, can do, we can do um. Retry. Uh, we could do. For or the dungeons. Or uh, we could do the dungeons or we could do some more extremes and see if we can get a, bir a bird. So we could do Bismarck again and we can do Thornton again. Let's do... I mean, Bismarck's probably the more, the smartest one then. I'll, I'll well, for you it's Bismarck and for Tombi it's Thornton. So reset yeah. oh, oh. Bismarck and reset Thornton for both of you and then we'll just go down both of those two again. Uh, which one was that? Uh, Limitless Blue. Limitless Blue. I don't even have that one. <laughs> I only yeah. have uh, oh well, I've got Bismarck. Yeah, I've got that one. Yeah. Yeah. And then for Tombi, his is the Thornton one at the bottom left corner. Yes, sir. <laughs> to reset. You want? Re yeah. Okay. Reset. Retry. Done. Yep. Okay. Ready right. when you are. Done. 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 Limitless Ready when blue you are. first. Yep. Gotcha. Sounds good. Sounds good. Sounds He's a good. A bridge. He's a <laughs> steel Egg, steel Egg loves the uh, lock it in emote, doesn't he? <laughs> yes, he does. Lo he locks it in like the letter A in caramel. <laughs> <laughs> Oof. Is there any uh, just um, steel Egg, is, there any, is there any other l word like caramel that you you guys are too retarded to say properly? Oh, aluminium. Yeah, no. aluminium. Al aluminium. Aluminium. Um, <laughs> al aluminium is is yes. Aluminium is another one. Aluminium so is aluminium. Aluminium. How do how do you say schedule? Schedule. Schedule. Oh yeah, that's fine. Because I think that uh, that one depends on the regional accent though. Yeah. I think New Yorkers like say sh like schedule. Sh schedule. Yeah. New New Yorkers say schedule. I know that for a fact. Yeah. What about lieutenant? Lieutenant. Lieutenant. Le lieutenant. No. There's left definitely tenet. no F in it. There's definitely no <laughs> F in it. <laughs> it's a lieutenant. I'm just fucking with you. It's lieutenant. I'm it's just fucking with you. Oh yes, fuck your face. Fuck your face. Wee! <laughs> yeah, sorry, uh, sorry, Mid, and I forgot to click the dragon thing. Okay, Cash, Cash got it. Yep. I was, I was, I was That's a good thing about having a fourth person with you, with us. <laughs> yeah, Someone can compensate for our fuck ups. <laughs> uh, That's a good Rick thing. Says, do you say? School or shul? School. Oh, we say school. School, school yeah. Oh, it's schedule. What? Why? 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 I know from my, I know from experience, people from the northeast cannot discern or tell the difference between the three different pictures, picture and picture. <laughs> <laughs> they just say picture. They say picture every time. Oh jeez. Yeah, but that's like the other one. Was it the guys from Boston saying iron? Uh, iron. Iron. Yeah. Iron. Aaron earned an iron urn. Baltimore accent. That's it. Chainsaw for the win. <laughs> There's me. I'm just fucking fucking around, not paying attention to anything. This this fucking is is this engagement with the guys in chat? Just gotta do it. Every now and again, yeah. just gotta add foliage. It. Foliage. Yeah, I mean foliage is fine. Mm. Um, but it's the equivalent of saying Italian or Iraq. Ira Iraq. <laughs> get in the middle. Get in the middle. Get in the middle. Yeah, a lot what? of the Americans all say Italian, Iraq. I'm like, no, it's Italy. Italy, <laughs> Italy, not Italy. <laughs> Italy. 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 It's like ideal. <laughs> it's like you know, it's like a thing. 
Hey, Bobby Boopy. Bobby Boopy. Boopy Doo Bobby. Bobby Boopy. Move. Can you hmm? test something for me? Can you just jump off the side? Fuck you. <laughs> how about no? See how long you fall. Uh, pr pretty long. I fell once, so yes. I know what I mean. No verb. Fuck. Is, is this video, guys? <laughs> That's the video I'm on about. And I just I don't know why I put it in Facebook. But fucking... <laughs> when did you put it in Facebook? Yeah, exactly. Uh, no, it's it's come from Facebook. Mm. I can nice. see the YouTube link to our pocket. Uh, no second row. Fuck. Oh, that's unlucky. <laughs> All right, I got two rows to. to I got three chances to clear one row. I want, Fuck. I want to put my fucking pink, my pink headphone sockets on again. Just to wind up Meza? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. What about them cat ears, by the way? I have to order them. I might just 3D print some and clip them on. Just ask Max where she got hers. Oh, <clears throat> N, N picks up a perfect one. Caribbean. Caribbean, yeah. Caribbean. 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 Or Caribbean. Caribbean. Or Caribbean. Caribbean. <laughs> Caribbean. Yeah. Caribbean. Caribbean. It's the Caribbean. It's the Caribbean. To the Caribbean. Fuck your face. So, <laughs> big puddles. Big puddles, big big puddles. Your judgment is Run away from each other, and then run into a tower, guys. Run into a tower. Yep, on my way. On my way, Jess. Okay, I'm free. Free falling. That way we don't have paralyzed now. <laughs> yeah. Yep. Fuck yeah, free somebody. What's funny is doing this solo and you're like, uh, there's four towers and I just want to make it. Yep. <laughs> West is safe, east is safe. Mm-hmm. By me. Boom. Shit. That's enough. Ah, there's another one. Zebra. There's a zebra. Zebra? Yep. It's Z. Z. It's Z, it's not Z. Zebra. <laughs> zebra. Zebra. Easy. Yeah. Zebra. 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 <laughs> zebra. <laughs> zebra. <laughs> I can I can already see where this is going. <laughs> when you just stay the fuck away from Tommy? Oh no. Semi. There's another one. Semi versus semi. So semi, semi truck. Semi. I say both. I say both. I say semi. It has to. It, it's it's a combination of both for me as well. Really yeah, it depends. It me. depends on the, the situation actually, for me. It really depends on the situation for me. Yeah. Wow. Well, that's you eating a lot of shit there. Yeah. Well, I'm just I'm healing myself. And it's all right. I'm, I made a mistake by looking at words that are different in UK versus US. It's a sound of interesting. Get your ass here with killing and see a little. Yeah. There you go. Right, I just scored. Scored. Scored it. Short. Look at the. Look at the <laughs> scone versus scone. Scone. Bath versus bath. Grass <laughs> versus grass. Ass and ass. <laughs> whatever, whenever it has ass in it, you have to say the ass. Yep. Worcester sauce versus Worcestershire sauce. Worcestershire. 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 Yeah. Worcestershire. <laughs> Vitamin versus vitamin. Vitamin. Error for a four with a pecan versus pecan. Pecan. <laughs> pecan. Pecan, yeah. Pecan. Pecan nut. Peek peek at them nuts. You <laughs> <laughs> can peek on my nuts. Peek on the nuts. Go <laughs> uh, of heavens. Pecan. Nope. None for me. Pop. Gay. Oh boy. Well, I Tommy will level. Let's see. Let's see what we get. Let's see what we get. 
I think I'll reset Bismarck again. Honestly. You can't. You've uh, you've completed your uh. nine. Yep. D damn it. No. Nope. So now now you can go collect. Ooh, okay. Uh, let's Idusha. do that then. Idleshear. <laughs> that's, that's another one, isn't it? Idleshear, Idleshear, Idleshear. Whatever the fuck it is. <laughs> it's, it's a pecan. 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 Yeah, that's right. Pecan. It's, it's pecan. Not pecan. <laughs> it's pecan. <laughs> pecan. 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 Not okay, pecan. Okay, Pikachu. Pecan. Come your tits. <laughs> Pikachu. 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 Like Pikachu? What's up, Pikachu? Are you guys capped on your uh, poetics or no? No. Um, Luckily good not. Actually. Good show. Uh, no. Not. Then grab not your five hundred. And, and the MGP, some. right? Grab okay. uh, yeah, MGP as well for your first for your lines. Yep. Oh, Alden, you're always helping Chloe so much. Chloe lo just loves you to death. <laughs> oh, boy. Careful now. <laughs> oh, yeah. Suck a dick. Oh, oh yeah. Tommy is now 77. Noise. Noise, of course. What, what else is going on here? <laughs> 13 levels to go. Mm -hmm. Crazy, right? right? So, back to the story, or what do you guys want to do? I think I might want to call it a date, actually. Oh, yeah, I don't know about Isn't you guys. It? Yeah, might, might as well yeah, call it's it a day. Quite for you now, isn't it? It is uh, two a.m. So might as well get some sleep as soon as I think uh, Saucy Saturdays is on anyway right right now. So yeah. I'm just gonna yeah I think Saucy yes well I think it is on but don't quote me on that one. Um, let's see. Title and description. No, that's fine. Luke's active. Script doctor's active. Uh, Demogenize active. Demogenize on. Active. Oh, okay. Yeah. That's good. Uh, let's see here. Doop, doop, doop. Why do you do that again? Who, who, should we, uh, who should we abuse? Oh, shit. I can do it as well, can't I? Yeah, I'm we monetized both can. now. We both can. Um, um, I don't know. Let's see. Who is, who's live right now? Which one's which one's my chat? Okay, this... Mo oh, Mola's still live with EFAP. Uh, Kara is <laughs> live with... Uh, as nah. they're playing a uh, power, power as. world, right? They've, they've got enough yeah. people watching. Yeah, I that's wanna, true. <laughs> I want to bump up. I want to bump up the little guys. So I'm almost tempted to fire over to Luke, to be honest. Luke doesn't um, even show up in my live feed currently. That's weird. I'm just gonna put it into my chat, mate. So yeah. it should come up on your screen. But how do you send people across? You go um, when you are in st in studio view. There's stream settings. Okay. Studio view. Does he have it enabled though? Does Luke have it en enabled? Probably not. No, because I can't send people to Luke then. Um, fucking hell. Who else is? Film Fred is having an upcoming stream. Mark still live? Honestly, I think I'll just send people to Mark. <laughs> where where does the option come up though? Um, you have uh, edit settings when you go into edit next to your stream name. Yeah, no, no, I've I've already, I've already gone in customization. Customization. Ah, right, okay. um, customization. Let's see. Um, boop, boop, boop. Right, legal mindset mm. playing Warhammer Warhammer Forty K conference controversy soon. We got Geeks and Gamers Tabletop coming up, but that's probably tomorrow. Uh, well, Mauler's Life, Kara, but they, they got plenty of people watching anyway. Is X-Ray up or no? She played uh, earlier. Well, well, yeah, she, but I don't see... Oh, no, she doesn't have uh, th that thing on, I think. Let's see. Yeah, in, in customization, I don't have a redirect or a... Um... I don't have an uh, it's um if Mark's only down, got eleven people. If you if you scroll yeah, down, Tommy, bumpy. with slow mode, you know where slow mode is and all that stuff. Um, it's below it's me... below message it's below message delay. Oh. Do you see uh, that? Uh I'm just stand by. <clears throat> it's not in customization for me. 
Weird. Community. Do you have it enabled? Code <laughs> yeah, yeah, I mean, I've got it enabled. Let's see here. Dup, dup. I'll just I'll just teleport to Kugani in the meantime, since we're still looking for someone to uh, uh, redirect to. And Not technically, you have a new uh, hotel to go to in the Crystarium. Oh, that, that is true. Yeah, that is true. You are very right, sir. Uh, but the Crystarium. Let's go. Right, Nadia is still alive, Tommy. Well, oh, well, there you go then. That's easy then. But she it doesn't have to redirect on, I'm afraid. So I'll just no, post I'll just the link in chat. People manually. Yeah, I'll just post the link in chat. So guys, yep. and the place is called the Pendants, by the way, Smooth. So you Pendants, gotcha. Oh yeah, that's the room that that the, that was shown to me at the beginning of the quest line. Right, so guys, the link I just posted beneath Tombies is uh, to Nadia's stream. She's building some Legos at, at the moment. So do show her some love, say hi to her, be nice, because uh, she's a good soul. And uh, yeah, thanks as always to Mirden, to Tombi, and uh, of course to Cash as well. Thank you, sir. Yep. Thank you guys Thank for you. being here. Yep. Thank you. And, uh, Thank you quickly to Era 404 for the yes. uh, the blurps. Thank you very much indeed to Bendover for the gifted memberships. Thank I mean, yeah, agree. Beyond. Yeah. Um, Steve, Psycho if you're Mongoose. in Thank you. in chat, if Steve, if you're in chat. Thank you very much indeed for the donation to Poppy's um, uh, physiotherapy. Yep. It's fucking absolutely amazing. I'm just looking yep. at the. You guys are stars. I don't think I missed anybody. Uh, Bombhead Brian, 20 quid yep. for the um, Poppy Steel Lego History. For Poppy, um, Psychotic Mongoose, obviously, with the gifted membership. Thank you very much indeed, guys. Um, yeah, absolutely. Thanks, guys. Fucking absolutely you guys are amazing I'm you guys are amazing guys. and uh, much much appreciated that you were hanging out with us to, on the saturday eve and um, we see you guys tomorrow Indeed. I, most likely so do you take care for let's now go, let's go to nadia let's go and to, let's go to think, nadia i don't think i picked up nadia's link let me just grab it from you and then I'll bye for now guys mine okay and great. Great. bye for now guys nadia good night snow Bye bye. See you in a second, sweet. Bye. That's great idea. Right, guys, bye. from me as well. Thank you, you very guys. much indeed to Cash. Thank you, Mirden. Smu, as always, you take care, brother. Get yourself some we'll rest. I yep. will see you all tomorrow. I'm just going to go mute on Discord. I'm going to jump Same into yeah. Nadia. Say bye to the remainder of the chat. But for now, guys, we'll you guys take care. I'll speak to you soon. God freaking speed. Guys, as always on my end as well. Thank you for very much indeed for watching. Uh, thank you for the generous donations and uh, memberships. And uh, see you guys tomorrow for some Baldur's Gate and uh, some yeah, probably some more Final Fantasy fourteen or Left for Dead, depending uh, how if we get the crew together for that one. Until then, do take care and uh, much love to you guys, and do show some love to Nadia. Until then, bye.